Alrighty, how's everyone doing today? Uh, we're gonna be playing some Spirit Fair. I got this game a long time ago and I never played it. I actually got it for stream. And I just, I just never played it. So, excited, now's a good time. Is it, is it loud? Um, it's a little loud. Gotta do some audio adjustment. Hello? Those are the music, but. All right. Anyway, this game doesn't have, it's either got windowed, which is actually a window. I guess you guys don't notice, so maybe that's fine. Doesn't have windowed full screen, which I'm real upset about. How could they do this in current year? But anyway, yeah, let's, uh, let's jump into this, shall we? I know this is like a pretty story focused game. But other than that, I don't know that much about it. I assume I'm just going to be doing a lot of reading of text. Unless it's voice acted. I don't know. Let's find out. Um, sure. Oh, you can play this game co-op? Oh, but it's only local though. Hmm. Interesting. I didn't know that was a thing. Who is this guy? Ah, oh, I see. He said, ah, but he didn't say finally. Come on, bro. It's just one word. Ah, oh, finally. Hmm? Hello? How do I? Clicking space bar. Wazda, how do I make this? How do I make the text continue? Is it because I put it in windowed? What? What? How do I? What? <laughs> do I need to enter maybe? Oh, interact E? Ah, okay, you gotta eat. I thought for a second you would never wake up, little one. How ironic that would have been, would it not? I'm Charon. Charon. Okay, well, he kind of said it. I don't, you know, I'm not gonna repeat it. Can I match his voice? It's much deeper than what I'm doing and less gristly. <clears throat> he was like, Spirit bearer. Well, that is what I have been until your arrival. I cannot say that I am sad to leave, but I still had a few things left to do here. I'm afraid you have to pick up things where I left off, or I left them. It is, after all, my very last day. And you are? Stella. Okay. Welcome, Stella. I see you have brought a friend here with you. What's his name? <laughs> He's just naming us all. I see. You two will share the burden then. And take it over from me. As I said, in a few minutes, I will be gone from this world. And that is why you are here. You will be the new spirit fair. <laughs> hey, this voice I'm doing is gonna be gone because he's gone. He's gone away. Listen. Listen, your task here will be far from easy, but simple nonetheless. Go fetch the stray spirits stranded on the islands, and when they are ready, bring them back here. Dying souls cannot pass away on their own. You will have to help them uh, fulfill their last requests and be at their service until their last breath. All right, buddy. Sure thing. <clears throat> the big round bridge over there is the Ever Door. The Alpha where everything starts. The Omega where everything ends. This is where all the quests get completed and where existence meets its threshold. There is no task more important than this. Uh, this one. Stay. 
never forget this, Stella. Here. There is something I need to give you. Now, be really careful with it. It is the Everlight. The symbol of your status here, and the only tool you will ever need. Wait, what are you... <laughs> like, uh, oh, oh, how highly inappropriate. Well, that settles it. Oh, <laughs> the cat got its own Everlight. The Everlight will help you throughout your travels. It will be the light that shines in darkness, the last remaining hope of the departed. All right. Oh, it's her belt buckle. And the cat's like collar. Listen. Hope is a flame. The light that never fal uh, falters. The beacon of eternity. It is heavy and inconvenient, but there's no greater duty than this one. The fate of lost souls rests on your shoulders. Look, I was overwhelmed too at first. Just trying to keep, just try to keep your focus. Take it one step at a time. You will soon get used to this place, accustomed to these moments. Spirit you are the new spirit fairs, after all. Just one thing. Thank you. Once I am gone, you will have to find a ship of your own. Mine is not suited for you, and it will fade away once I am gone. You might find one not too far from here if you if you keep rowing in the right direction for some time. Probably. It's time. Here I go. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye-bye. <laughs> so long, Stella, and good luck. You will need it. All right, bye, big guy. He gone. We got to get a boat. We got an oar. Wait, we we gotta actually row? I mean, I'm not rowing. This game's doing it. But... There's like a town. What is this? There's a little person up there. Space water jump. Hold space water jump higher. Oh, I just barely can jump that. All right. Right here. Hello. Oh, E to interact. What's up? Stella! It's really you! Stand up straight. Let me get a look at you. Who is this person? Wait, how do they know who we are? You look good. And Daffodil is here too, I see. We have to find a lint roller then. True. Cat hair, man. It's everywhere. I might, uh, it might not be that obvious after all. It's me, Gwen. Good thing you found me. Who's Gwen? Mm -hmm. If you hear, it means, oh, you are the new spirit fairer. Mm -hmm. You are the one replacing Charon. I was trying to get rid of him and only ended up here by accident. I've been stuck on this disgusting island for about a week, living off sardines and cigarettes. That doesn't... That's, that's kind of gross. Mm -hmm. Funny how I used to be the one uh, getting you out of trouble before. I can see you have an Everlight now. Mm -hmm. Of course. See that boat over there? Hey, it's our boat. That's a nice looking boat. I mean, kind of. It needs to be cleaned up a little bit. What? Mm -hmm. It's obviously slightly shabby, but, it's co but let's commandeer it. I'd wager... It will work since you're the spirit fair. Okay, meet me on deck over there. Hey. I'll explain it all. All right, sure thing, bud. Well, let's go. It's down here. Nothing. Uh oh. Hey, you're not supposed to fall there. <laughs> it will block you if you fall. <clears throat> How did I miss this jump? What? 
I'm definitely jumping high enough. All right. All right. Come on, video game. There you go. So what is this? We got some... <clears throat> is this an easel or something? Is this my room right here? It looks like my room. What's going on up here? Hello. Okay, here goes. Hope my fur cart won't be too damaged. Wonderful. I'm not one to jump for joy, but this feels good. Much better than anticipated. Mm -hmm. So, the way I see it, this boat's yours now. Don't, don't you think? Mm -hmm. Good. And as you're the spirit fair, welcome stray spirits is your new job. And once aboard, they'll assume their true forms. Well, it's my theory anyway. Why are you looking at me like that? Mm -hmm. You need to come here and give me a hug. <clears throat> New request. Personal connection. Hug. Mood. Food. Give. Alright, well, they wanted me to hug them, so. Mm. I like how they were surprised, even mm. though they told me to do it. Much better. Come with me now. Let's take a look at, the, at this chaos. Who is this person? How do they know so much? A couch. Oh, no. I'm going to interact with the couch. Mm -hmm. Hang out. Oh, no. What? How do I how do I get off the couch? Oh, escape. Mm -hmm. What a mess. Reminds me of Aunt Petunia's old yard. A beautiful, unorganized uh, testament to someone's laziness. Mm -hmm. A vital impossibility to get rid of anything. At any rate, we should do something about this. Or well, my dust allergies will be back. Let me think. Her dust allergies. Lady, you were smoking a cigarette. Mm -hmm. There's only one way to clean this up. You have to meet Albert. Mm -hmm. He's your local shipwright, and his jokes are garbage. <laughs> but he's the only one who could fix your boat. Mm -hmm. We should head to Albert's shipyard. Must be wondering how to make this ship move. Mm -hmm. Really easy, actually. There, let me give you this key I found on the island. It will unlock the cabin in the mm -hmm. back. You should find a map projector in there. How do I know all this? Well, I was planning escape, remember? Mm -hmm. And you know me. I plan things meticulously. Very mm -hmm. meticulously. Go open that cabin, Stella. Mm -hmm. The map projector should simply, uh, should be simple enough to use, and you just have to go to Albert's shipyard. All right. Yeah, <clears throat> this is our place. Alt Harbor. Albert's shipyard. What is this? Oh, the Everdoor. What is this? There's a bus stop. All right, I guess we're gonna go visit Albert. Wait, is she inside with me? No, she's outside, right? Is she? Yeah, she's outside. As I understand, the ship is powered by your Everlight. That's how it cruises the oceans and reveals the stray spirits. Also explains why I couldn't do anything by myself. You must admit, it's quite fascinating. Look. I know you must feel overwhelmed. Mm -hmm. Sharon, the Everdor, the Spirit Fairs, this place, this boat, me being here. It's a lot. You must be wondering what's going on. Or what it, yeah, mm -hmm. I said it right. Truth be told, I don't really know either, but I'm here for you. Do my best to help you and try to make sense of it all. Mm -hmm. As I said earlier, I wanted to leave by myself, but somehow I just couldn't. Now that I see you, I think I know why. I'll give you some space for now. Don't hesitate to explore this mm -hmm. ship. Even give that fishing rod a try. The world is your oyster. All right, sick. I have a bell. I didn't do anything. Oh, this is fishing. That's what it is on the back. How do you wait for the bobber and hit E? Maybe? Question mark. Oh, hold E to reel. Is there like line tension or anything? No, you just hold E. All right, sick. And so there is like travel time. It takes a while. Maybe it slows down because I'm doing an activity. Not really sure. Oh, I bet my cash would like some my cash. My cat would like some fish.
It's interesting that the cat has an Everlight. I'm sure that is going to be important in the future. All I'm catching is herring. Oh, we're arriving. We are here. Yeah, I'm busy. Oh. I don't want to do the main story yet. I, I got to do figure out what everything else is going on around here. So I have a bell. I have a couch. There's a seagull. What do I do with this fish? Oh, I can get up top here. There's a bird's nest here. I can't interact with my cat. We have a bell. I can get on the roof too. Oh, there's nothing up here. There's this little dinghy. I assume that's for just going out though. Can I sleep up here? Probably eventually or something, but because we're like still doing the tutorial or whatever. Now head down to Abbott Shipyard and upgrade your blueprint station. Only way to clear this clutter. Curious about what it's all made of. Mm. During the smell, I'd say at least seven types of dirt and dust. All right. I guess this is how you disembark to like whatever, wherever you are. Hello. Oh, you pulled our ship out of the water. Welcome to my shipyard, young traveler. Where my prices are a customer's best friend. <laughs> I am Albert. Been in business for shipbuilding for ages. Should I assume you are the new spirit fair? Well, of course you are. Anyway, you've been able to start this ship and bring it here after all. Ben was right to point you towards my humble enterprise. Ah, let me see what you have here. Nice little dinghy. Funny how it looks exactly like the one I'd uh, built some time ago and stored in my old shipyard. See, Sharon wasn't unhappy about his gloomy and dank arc. Actually, he was always complaining about everything. But the customer's always right. So I built him a newer, better one. Of course, he would never abandon his previous boat. Old habits die hard. But don't worry, you can keep this one. Let's just call this a loan. And tell me something. You know, we always joke, uh... You know, we always joke about the construction here? Don't worry. We're still working on it. <laughs> I don't get it. What? Anyway, a little bit of love, this bird will be res uh, resplendent again. First thing you need is a proper blueprint table. Since it's your lucky day, I'm feeling generous. I'll offer it to you. Free of charge. Mind you, just a bit bare bones in terms of functionality. But the subsequent upgrades will come at such, such a small price, you'll want to buy them almost immediately. Simply direct me to upgrade the ship. All right, sure thing, bud. I'll get my ship yard. My price is the best customer, blah, 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 blah. All right. I need a blueprint thing, bud. Guest house, garden, field, kitchen. Cost zero. This is my currency, whatever the hell this is. Oh, 400? What the? And I need a log and limestone. Medium-sized boat that will make you slip away in style. The intrepid otter. Wait, this is a small... Wait, the ship I have now is a small ship? What? I would not call my current ship small. Sawmill, loom, foundry, orchard, sheep corral, windmill. Okay. Uh, you'll be able to build and edit your buildings on the, on your boat. What a treat. But if you really want to upgrade your boat in size and, and in pleasure, I'm your guy. Come back when you feel your boat is getting too crowded. Cheers. All right. See you, bud. Time to go home with my boat. <clears throat> Good. Albert gave it to you for free. And he said he loaned you the, he loaned the ship to you. Ominous. I don't know what he has in mind, but it doesn't sound reassuring. Anyway, let's focus on, uh, focus on the task at hand for now. Cleaning up this deck. Go to your new blueprint temple above your cabin and select the move option. And able to remove any building and get back resources. Go for it. I'll wait down here. 
Okay, lady. Edit. Why is there a star? Uh oh. Junk pile. Salvage. Ooh, look at all this stuff. Old carpet, old shoe. Empty bottle. I think the only thing here that seems valuable are the logs. <clears throat> I guess it is kind of small, right? This is so this is our building area. I guess so. You take pictures or something? Cool. All right, all done. You did a wonderful job, Stella. And good news is that you have enough resources to add a guest house to your ship. A necessary amenity. Really welcome spirits such as myself will have a temporary place to relax and sleep. Well, sleep? Not really. I can tell you for sure that no one will be thrilled to spend more than one night in there. But it beats sleeping on the deck. The stars are pretty, but the wood is stiff and the humidity is hard to tolerate. I'll leave you to it. Have fun. Alright. Uh, field. Guest house. Everybody's welcome in the guest house. Uh, I guess we'll just put it close to the back. Oh, space bar is not the right button. We have a bunch of other stuff, but I can't. I don't actually have. I can't build it. Cooking and stuff. Oh, she's gonna go get into the guest house here. Oh, there's not a bed in here. What? There's only a couch. This guest house is very pretty. It has your touch. Nice work as usual. Now at last I have a place to sit down and enjoy the view. Oh, wait. What is going on? Something else is happening. Ah, should have expected this. I'm actually hungry. Very hungry. I know, I know how terrible, or you know how terrible cook I am, but I remember you being absolutely fantastic at it. Might have uh, fished a few fishes already. Trouble is, I can't really eat an entire raw fish. Could try for sure, but I'll probably choke on the fishbone and never survive. <laughs> That's not how you want me to go. As absurd as this sounds, so you should keep on using the blueprint table of yours and build a kitchen aboard. I'm pretty sure I've seen plans for it in there. As well as the necessary resources. Damn, you require bright jelly. Only one way to get some I look I should have told you when I first met you here something scares the hell out of me a dark presence and even I cower from it a void that swallows all light included can't take many form. it can take many forms and for me it always it, it is always jellyfish yes I'm fully aware of the irony the bright jelly you need for the kitchen well only these jellyfish can provide it to you so there is no other option I have to face my fears but you're here. With you, I can do it. It will appear as a dark patch of pure fear on your map. So you can't miss it. I'll go take some time to prepare myself. I see. Is this what we're going to have to do with all of our guests? We're going to have to help them face their fears and stuff? Hey, look. There's islands. I can't go there yet. There's this bus stop again. And here's the fear thing. Oh, oh, can I actually go there? Oh, no, I can't. Oh, I can. Yeah, I can just sail into the darkness. Mm, yeah, I don't have any more resources, so. I guess I just go fishing. I don't have any other activities. I can go in and talk to her. Has no food. Their mood. Shops for fibers, shops for threads, uses the loom. Optimus in our new journey was recently hugged. She likes to be hugged. Hey. Thanks, but that won't be necessary. Hey. Don't ask me how, but I've met Albert already. He definitely is a shark. But his interest in all things Marantime will be helpful, such as the boat upgrades he sells and our side prices. Those will be able to cross ominous weather barriers in the world. It look like classic mythical challenges again. A cliche if you ask me. Wait, did her happiness go down because I talked to her? Oh no, she's hungry. Yeah. Yeah, I'm working on it, lady. Sorry, 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 sorry.
Well, <clears throat> it's a little, a little spooky in here. I caught a regular herring again. Here we are. Damn. Here they come. Remember, set your eyes on the on the ones with bright jelly. They should be visible enough. That said, pop as many as you can. You'll get glimpses anyway. I'll wait for you inside. It's just too hard for me to stay out there. Okay, go go ahead. I believe in you. All right. Oh, okay. They're gonna like show up on deck. Oh, so this is how you get resources. This is the currency, Glims. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Why, you're so high. Can I get on the roof here? Oh, but I slide. I need to get on up here. What? No, how do I get up there? It's too high. Oh, okay. Oh, interesting. I can, like, just slide and jump on the roof like that. Back here, you son of a gun. Oh, shit. I fell. Eh. Dude, it's hard to get all of them. Oh my lord, that's a lot. Oh my god, it's so many. Oh, I missed that one. I mean, I think we did pretty good. Fantastic. Okay. I'm really impressed. You rocked out there. Mm -hmm. Tumbling and diving like a shooting star and without the slightest fear nor hesitation in that. You definitely haven't lost your touch, mm -hmm. Stella. And you've gathered enough bright jelly to build a proper kitchen. Go for it. I'll, pa I'll be patiently waiting. Slowly digesting myself. <laughs> All right, lady. Listen, quit being a little sourpuss. Oh, I can build this on top of her thing. Interesting. You can also just like build it up in the middle of nowhere for no reason. I'm going to build it on the ground though. Oh, now I'm out of logs. I cannot build anything else. Lovely kitchen. And I use the kitchen's oven. It should be rather simple. Put any one ingredient in the oven and wait for it to be cooked. You could even try these loose corn kernels that I've been hanging around my, in my pockets. Can't wait to see your cooking glory again. You got this. I can only cook one item at a time. I can cook some logs. <clears throat> corn is a golden grain. Tons of different uses. Sometimes corny. Can be ground into corn flour in a windmill. That sounds useful. Is it done? No, it wasn't done. Yeah. I just got my herring back. I think I have to wait for the timer here. The one whole rotation? That uh, takes a while. I need a better kitchen, man. We can't be doing this one one ingredient dish. Hey, what's up? Hey. I'm delighted that you're here with me, but I'm not surprised one bit. It adds mm -hmm. up. You here taking care of me in, in my final hours? I've always cared so damn much about others. I've always protected those you found vulnerable. Even pedantic snobs like me. Remember the day my father yelled at the mm -hmm. cat? just got out of elementary school. You were wearing those blue sneakers with glittery tags. And there you were, yelling back at my father like you were on a mission. Yeah. Father turned red and smashed the purple Delvano case. It was rad. Does it 
does it stop or does it can i burn it if i leave it in there grilled fish let's cook something else let's cook one of these corns oh yeah look that's like super fast made popcorn let's cook another fish that one takes way longer I could eat anything. Just give me some food. Um, meal size snack, dish type comfort, meal size small, dish type plain. Well, I won't die just yet. Thanks, Stella. It's better than I thought it could be. But then again, you've always been a wonder in the kitchen. Don't forget, spirits don't run on sunshine and water. You need a good meal once in a while. It'll be up to you to understand who's fond of what. As for me, I'm sure you remember. Always loved comfort food. And I would die for a cup of coffee. Hell yeah, man. But I'm not that picky. I can eat anything. Just never the same thing twice. Oh, and before I forget, here's something I was supposed to give you. Not sure exactly how it works, but an obol is a symbol of passage. It's a, a fee each spirit has to pay you. Something tells me you knew that already. Okay, let's keep on improving this craft. <clears throat> As you must have seen in your blueprint table, there's a both a field and a garden. Which means you can grow many different things. And turn this ship into an adorable farm of sorts. You should add a field first, in my opinion. It's going to be easier to find resources for it around here. You can grow linen in it, which can turn will be used to craft more important more important things. In addition to building a field, you should go buy seeds to use in it. That will come later. I need you to visit an island close by. It's called Mostine Cove, and there's something on it we need. I'll tell you when we get there. Is it burnt? Can you burn it? It was not burnt. She does like... She said she likes comfort food and popcorn is a comfort food. I'm going to go give her some comfort food. Ah, yes. I forgot to tell you about this. As you can see, this boat stops at night. I believe it's a side effect of your Everlight being, well, lit. Or some other technicality. That being said, it will allow people to sleep undisturbed. You in the meantime can do anything you want. Tackle unfinished business or just chill on deck under the stars. Just you go to sleep too in that cozy little room atop mm -hmm. your cabin. You wake up refreshed and ready to go and this ship will start up again in the morning. Oh, and talking about that. You know me, waking up on time has never been my forte. Ring the bell over there to wake people up. Remember, only do it at the right mm -hmm. time. Early mornings should do the trick. Speaking of which, time for me to take a nap. See you tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Have a good night. Wait, no, don't come back. Son of a gun tried to get away. Oh, thank you. I'm not hungry. Oh. Favorite foods, black coffee. Doesn't say what she dislikes. So I can just keep cooking at night, seems like. If I wanted to cook a bunch of food. I don't think there's really much else to do. I think we just sleep through the night at this point. I wonder if you can still fish and stuff, too. So nighttime is just like a time to do resource management stuff. I imagine crops and whatnot don't grow. Proceed to toggle, toggle the clock and trick to just play on and off. No, we'll leave that on. That seems pretty nice to have on. Wakey, wakey, bitches. Good morning. Are you hungry? How do you know if they're hungry? I guess they'll it'll affect their mood or something. Let's see if she wants food. No, nope, not hungry. All right, she wants us to go somewhere. Some cove or something. Up here. Mustine Cove. I guess that's what we'll do. If I go fishing, am I going to get more fish other than herring? Or is it just going to be herring still? Where's my sea bass or, or swordfish or something crazy? An old, old shoe. Hold up. Now we're fucking talking, buddy. I think I got two from... Getting rid of the, the trash on my ships. Now I have three old shoes. Uh, 
another herring. It doesn't look like the clock's moving. Oh. Okay, so it just it just hard clicks it over every now and then. It's not like a steady rotation. I have not ate anything yet today. IRL. Nor my character has ate anything. I don't think your character eats. Seagull, we eating good. Come here. Hello. We're here. Look at that. Mostine Cove discovered. We should hop on that island over there. Maybe we'll find something interesting. All right. Are you, are you coming? You guys leave the ship? Oh yeah, look, she's coming with. Come on, dear lady, let's go. I don't know what we're doing over here, but. Let's head over. That was a lootable thing. Here we go. What a majestic tree. You can cut it down. <laughs> yes, it's fine, I promise. The best way to get actual wood you need. Or actually get wood you need. But don't worry, they'll regrow over time. Another interesting fact about the Everlight. <clears throat> oh. Interesting. <laughs> <laughs> the cat's just holding on for dear life, man. There's berries over there, too. Watch out, cat! Nice. Can I get these berries? Yep. What about these berries? Alright, what do you want? Congratulations! For you have become death, the destroyer of worlds! <laughs> How do you do that in her voice? You have become death, the destroyer of worlds! Joke, joke aside, that's how you do it. Go on ahead, cutting down more trees. And we can go back to the boat and uh, build a field with all those maple logs. I'll be next to the raft. Alright, I'm gonna go exploring. You have become death, destroyer of worlds! I don't know how to do that. What's the best way to... Oh, and that was a lot faster. I think I was, I think I was short, shorting it before. <laughs> the cat does not like the water. Oh, we got some minerals. Hold E as long as possible. Oh, I see. Without it like freaking out. So that was that was too long again. Okay, there's our limestone. Can I go swimming? Oh, I can swim. I like the cat. Wait, I can swim off screen? Because it takes like now I'm swimming left. Okay. So it doesn't seem like you can go that far off screen. Cat just wants nothing to do with the water. Accurate. Well, I got some limestone. Got some berries, got some logs. Got a bunch of resources, we're set. Are they gonna like hide stuff behind this? Whatever. You want another hug yet? Apparently. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Eating a meal she likes. Okay. I guess she's still not hungry. Uh, snack. It's a healthy meal. 
Okay, she's not hungry still. All right, let's go, lady. Come on. Oh, I didn't talk to you. Oh, it's because you don't want to talk. All right, let's go, lady. Come on. We're going back to the ship. Now I can build a field. I can't build a garden. Taste the lightning in a bot. Holy shit, this thing is absolutely massive. I can move stuff around, though. All right, hold on. Put you over here for now. I think I'm going to put that on top of the field. It's nice that you can just move stuff freely. Alrighty. A field. Ah, it's better looking than I thought. There is a little je ne sais quoi to it. Simple, but elegant. Now all you have to do is plant field seeds in there. Seeds can grow in their respective places. Garden seeds won't grow in the field, so don't bother trying. But you know me, I could, I would kill a plastic cactus, so don't take my word on this. Anyway, only one place where we could possibly find what we need. Theodore's special, Theodore specializes in seeds. Set up a shop in Hummingburg, the busiest town of the area. Theodore and his brothers are the founders of Raccoon Inc. A shady retail franchise with very loose moral values. Yes, this road has a serious problem. Dubious business practices. Since I don't want to get swindled, I'll come with you and do most of the talking. I wouldn't want you to get swindled. I run in this cheeky little raccoon, wa raccoon once and his dishonesty was blatant. Said to humming, hummingbird then. All right. I can't plant this corn. No item seeds. I have corn though. Corn's a grain. Come on now, bruh. Uh, how do I travel? Here. Oh, here's another, another thing. Um, we'll go get the seeds first though. We'll, we'll, we'll stay on task. I guess we'll fish again. Seems like there's nothing else to do while traveling. Although I guess you can do anything you can do while you're just sitting here doing nothing while traveling. The uh, tutorial part of this game pretty long. We're still just like learning about the game. My assumption is, you know, I'll eventually, I am the spirit fair. I need to, I need to help people pass through the arch. I guess maybe that's what we'll do with this chick first, eventually, once she's done teaching us everything. The day cycle seems pretty long though. Say so we're gonna make it to town before night. <clears throat> I wonder if there are other things to catch than herring. And I guess old shoes, because you do catch those as well. Where is she? Oh, there she is. Hummingberg discovered. All right. All right. We're here. Let's buy some seeds. Theodore set up a shop on the island. Let's pay him a visit. All right, let's go. Away we go. Dude, look at all these, like, what the hell are you guys? Can I go into random houses? Hello, I'm in your house. Oh, there's treasure in here. I got turnips and carrots. Oh, there's a, a ladder back here that's hidden. You can just go into all the houses and there's like treasure. Look, there's treasure right there too. More seeds. Can I read this book? I can sit on the seat. I cannot read the book.
There doesn't appear to be anything in there. All right, let's talk to... Oh. Talk to you. Mm -hmm. Oh, my next game will be ready soon. Crunch the data and spent five nights theory crafting. Clearly, if you take the heavy weapon efficiency from the mountain gnome race, there's a nifty synergy at level three rogue ability of this rate. It's for sure a bit weird, but hey, 5d20 and an auto crit on throne can't be defeated, am I right? Oh yeah, bud. This guy's fucking theory crafting. Hello. I'm going home. Don't follow me, please. I hate when uh, people know where I live. You know my address, you'll tell people. Then they'll tell people. Listen, just don't want, I just don't want junk mail. All right, that's a little weird. Take a look at the shrine, Stella. It's simply stunning. Some objects in this world are meant to resonate with the spirit fair and the Everlight. I've heard this monument has the power to enhance the Everlight's abilities. Two slots need to be filled up. Are they certain you could use obols to activate it? But to get obols, you'll need to become, you'll need to welcome more spirits on your ship. I'm sure you'll soon find more lost souls like me. When in the air, press space bar again to double jump. Interesting. I'm, I'm out here looking for uh, the right house to start a family. My wife sent me out to find something that might fit our needs. A garden, maybe a pool. I'm not asking for much, I just can't decide. I know that you can't help me, but it helps to say it out loud. I might stumble on the rarest of finds. Starting to annoy me. Because they're home and I tried to go to there. My first spot is, is this bench at the end of the pier. It's beautiful and quite peaceful after a long day's work. Oh my, I shouldn't have told you what I wanted to keep. Uh, shouldn't have told you if I wanted to keep it that way. True, now I'm going to go invade your favorite spot. I simply adore your hat. Our local shop, Raccoon Inc., only carries garbage wares. Seeds, logs, rocks, all useless to me. I need, I need me a hat like yours. All right. Uh oh. Let me guess. I'm a bit of a psychic, you know. Your name is Mary or Mar... 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 Margaret. It's Missy. Wait, no. Esh. Don't tell me it's... Oh, shoot. I'll get it someday. I don't think you're... I don't think you're doing anything but guessing, buddy. Yeah, hold on. I'm not talking to him right now. It's locked. Oh, you need double jump to go up there. Oh, because it's nighttime. There's a thing right there I want. There's Theodore. Go ahead and take a look at what he's selling. Hello, Theodore. Let's talk. Step right up, potential prospect. Welcome to Raccoon Inc. We've been servicing hum Hummingburg since forever. You've got the glims, I've got the goods. I've got all the ways to make you send those hard-earned glims. Step right up. All right. What do you got, buddy? You got a key. Hey, that's a lot. The key opens the door next to the broken ladder. Is that ladder right there considered the broken ladder? 500,000 glims. Um, that's kind of a lot, bud. Linen, corn, coffee, carrot. These are all also way too expensive. I can't buy anything. I think, uh, I think Missy here is going to give him a, mm -hmm. those prices are out of control. I won't let him get away with this. Are you ready to see me obliterate this merchant? Mm -hmm. Yeah, buddy, do it. Theodore, I know what you're doing here and you should be ashamed of yourself, you trash panda. Mm -hmm. People like you are the reason we have middle fingers. Oh. What? Madam, what's the meaning of this? Hmm. My friend here is the new spirit fairer, but she's not a newbie, and neither am I. Hmm. A little scam of yours won't work on us. But I I can assure you my business practices are quite above the board. Hmm. He warned you, treacherous striped weasel, and will tolerate this behavior one more second. No more shenanigans, no more double crosses, hmm. just fair prices. I, I, hmm. <clears throat> stop being so dishonest at once. The next time I see you, I'll try being nicer. You start being smarter. Got it? But, yes. Yes, of course. I promise you I'll adjust my prices. I beg you, please don't scold me anymore. 
I'll even give you a discount. Hey, you. Yes, you. And really gave that greedy merchant some hell. Go though like you could possibly join the upstairs crew. You want to come up, don't you? See it in your eyes. Not gonna lie, it's pretty cool being up here. Yeah, all the best people are up here. Don't get too excited, though. Somebody have broke the ladder. Have to jump inhumanly high to make it. I guess you could also use the stairs in that house. Some other dude lost the key. Well, anyway, see ya. Upstairs crew forever. Do you need double jump? Or you need to be able to buy the key from this guy? You're Stella, if I recall correctly. I'll never forget a face, especially if they have shiny glims. Don't be shy. Have a look if you fancy. All right, buddy. What do you got? What's the price now? 5,000? Okay, that's more reasonable. Okay, these prices are more reasonable. Buy one of each of these. These are all field seeds, so... These are gar garden. I can buy limestone and wood from him. I feel like it's not worth it, though. Is my sell pricing better? No, it's the same. Bright to jelly. Oh, odd substance that doesn't go on toast. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. I got everything you need. I'll take my leave. Feel free to stay here as long as you want. I'll meet you at the pier. No, we're done here. I'm going to beat you there, lady. I think we're done here. Oh, never mind. There's something on the roof. How do I get up there? I think I need double jump to get up there. It's up there. It's on the roof. I need a second obol. Is there one on this roof too? No. Oh. <laughs> I for a little slim there. By accident. It's too dark to navigate. Yep. Yeah, it's not too dark to plant some seeds, bud. Linen. Corn. Coffee. No, I don't really need corn. I already have corn, but whatever. What up? Are you alive? She looks dead. I guess she's sleeping. Is the story there? Oh, if you if you sit, you look at the stars. What is this? Okay, well, I guess they sleep standing up. Bedtime! Wonder how long it takes for plants to grow. Down we go. Oh, she's still asleep. I need to ring the bell. Wake up! <laughs> Looks great. Way ahead of me, Stella. Your thumb is as green as your hat. This boat will soon become a cozy floating farm. Don't forget that you'll probably have to water the plants once in a while. Don't ask my word for it, though. My garden knowledge is limited as my father's empathy to find better mentors than me, which reminds me. I believe it's time for you to find find new people. Not that I don't love the idea of just two of us cruising the oceans, but you are the spirit fair. Spirit fair is fine spirits. Yes, help them fulfill their last wishes, however mundane they may be. We're at a place not far from here where someone might be in need of your help. And I'll bet you'll like this one. He is, if he is who I think he is. Go, let's sail. All right. How do I know when I need to water them? Okay, I watered it. I see no indicator that it has been watered or needs to be watered though. I can just water it over and over and over. Can I overwater my plants and kill them? <laughs> just water it forever? I mean, I assume you only need to water each once. That's my assumption. I could go for an amuse. What the hell is that? 
Oh, she's hungry. I can give her popcorn. She likes popcorn. She likes comfort foods. Oh, thank you, Stella. I love comfort food so damn much. She is now ecstatic. Oh, when she's... Oh. If you get them in higher moods, they do stuff. So at her ecstatic mood, she harvests fiber. And before that, she uses the loom and she shops. And before that, she chops for oh, fiber, thread, uses the loom, harvest fiber. I see. If you keep them happy, they'll do stuff for you. Mm. Nice. So it's semi-important that you do keep them happy. There's this still. Oh, we're going to go through some storms. Resources found. Oh, you can get lightning in a bottle in a storm. We need some of that for our garden. Guess it's time to go get some lightnings in a bottle. What are you doing, lady? I mean, I don't know how long till I'm in the storm. I assume I will need to do stuff when we enter the storm. Okay, we are entering the storm. I guess it rains first and then the storm. Yeah, now we are in the storm. Where do I get it? Does, does she know? Oh, she's probably in her house. Avoiding the rain. Not a fan of this weather. All right, well. I didn't get any lightnings in a bottle. And I think we're through the storm already. Well, <laughs> that didn't work. I would get something. Maybe, I guess we need to end maybe. Like, stop in the storm? Probably what it is. You probably need to stop there and not just, not just drive through it. Okay. No more talking? All right, we just got to go on our own now. She's done being our baby mentor. take this tree I don't think there's any upside here of being fast you just need to make sure you do malt like the full the full left right to actually get the tree I was doing like little cuts here let's test it yeah see this is like not doing anything You need to make sure you hit the end of each uh, movement. Interesting. Hey. Oh, great. You're here. Listen. I just dropped a lemon in that pond. My fingers were all sticky. Just sort of slipped. Why? Good question. I've been eating delicious berries all day. Look at my hands, I swear. I've been experimenting. I'm gonna squeeze a little bit of citrus on these wild fruit. Now it's just berries, no twist. Unless it's just down there in the water. I do it myself, but I have these uh, pulpy fruits to take care of. Okay. I guess we gotta go diving. Hold S and spacebar to dive. That's the one! This guy's a frog. You can see his little shadow. I just need to find a, a tissue or something. I don't wanna get bear juice all over it. I 
Never mind. Just hold on to that lemon for me. Don't go and squeeze it. Wait a minute. Maybe you could help me. Silent is fresh out of food. My stomach always feels empty. Maybe it could help you, uh, help, uh, help you out aboard your ship with cooking, fishing, and building. I don't have my spices and tools, but I'll make it work. Don't think about it so much. Let's just go to your boat. Okay. I ate all the berries. What the hell? He chopped down all the trees, too. This fucking guy. Mm, find a passenger. Oh, there's a passenger in Hummingbird, too. Uh, it's probably from the upper area. Oh, wow. This boat is amazing. Here comes the real kicker, you little rascal. You're ready for a family reunion. Flashbang. What's up, frog? It's me, Stella. Your uncle, Atul. Surprised? Happily, I hope. I've been on that island for a while now. Can't wait to see the sights and the sea with you. I was uh, lonely with my thoughts. Now I got you, Sprout. Let's set sail for a great adventure. Onwards. Wait a second. Is that a... He excited about the fishing? He likes fishing? I knew it! That's a Seamaster 2000! I've actually never seen one in action. Well, I heard the rumors. Apparently, you can catch the biggest and brightest fish out there. Wow, Stella. Turn out to treat yourself. Wait a darn second. You're missing a few bolts. Let me guess. You've been fishing out mostly garbage. Well, not anymore. Oh, he's helping us out. Yeah, that's why I've only been getting herring. You'll see the difference immediately. Give it a go for a fan. Okay. You're gonna get better fish now? What you got for me, frog? Ooh. Okay, so now we have to deal with that. They added a mechanic, the, the tension. Tension mechanic. Hey, we got a squid. Hold on, Frogo. I'm catching fish. I got new fish. Got new mechanics. No longer just a hold E mechanic. Oh. Oh. This one's a toughie. Come on. Quit it. Come in. Come over here and get cooked up. A cod. All right. Let's go talk to him. Great job, Sprout. They never stood a chance. You sure don't mess around. That's what makes you a pro. If this ace level fishing has gotten me all rattled up. Which reminds me, I had this shiny thing in my pockets on the island. No idea what it does. Maybe you can hold on to it. For safekeeping, I suppose. Oh, brother, I need to take a breather. Oh, and by the way, you might be curious. It might have already tried, but yes. Water is very salty. Well, I'll go take a look around. You can fish your heart's content if you want. The water is very salty. Yeah, it's ocean water. You got two O-Balls. Remember that shine in Hummingbird? Go we'll try and add them there. You're lucky. You might add, might do something amazing. Ah, you'll have wasted your time. You should go see. <laughs> How do I know when I actually need to water this stuff? Maybe, maybe I'll we'll find someone who will tell me how fishing works. Oh, I can kick, cook this squid and stuff that I got. All right, let's go set sail again. It's gonna be nighttime soon though. Oh, here's another 
Another place. Ooh, what is this? Green Halton Bay. Look, a new dark area too. But we gotta go here to Hummingbird. Hummingburg. I guess we'll fish while we wait. And then I think a little thing will show up when my food's done. That one was easy because it was an old shoe. Never had high tension. Where are the frogs going to like the rain? Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the bobber. Is this also an old shoe? Oh, a fancy vase. Oh. Hey, look. Come quickly. This is what I call a storm. Your special person would never let their friend get hit by lightning. But I think you should try it. You have never lay. It will protect you. Lightning bolts will cast sparkles we are about to hit. Rush toward those. Oh, I almost forgot. You got any empty bottle? Or lightning with an empty bottle, you get lightning in a bottle. Isn't that bananas? This world. Lightning and bottle are a pretty handy resource. So come here quick, equipped. As a head start, here are a few bottles for you. But don't worry, they're pretty easy to come by. You ready for a thrill of your life? Okay, where's the lightning? Oh, okay, we're doing the thing now. Oh, it's up there. My food's done. Fuck. Couldn't get down in time. My cat's getting zapped. Oh, the cat can get zapped? That works? Oh, there's one. Oh, I get glimpsed for this, too. Oh, they spawn immediately. I just need to see them. Takes me a while to find them sometimes. I think I'm out of bottles. I'm getting a lot of glims though. up there. We're done? Oh, thank goodness. I, I wasn't sure if you were going to make it for a second there. You gave your old uncle quite a scare. Did you feel that rumble? What a rush. Look pretty awesome catching those jolts of lightning all over the boat. Thanks for being the best captain I could have ever hoped for. Sure. You're welcome. Oh, my food's done. I guess you can't burn it. Seems like that or the event like protected it or something. Yeah, I need like the upgraded kitchen. Let's me cook more than one ingredient at a time. Oh, it's night time. Are you hungry, buddy? Loves the way rain feels on his skin. Repairs buildings on the boat. Harvests wood. Makes planks. You hungry? You wanna find dining? Give him a plain fish. Oh boy, I just love food. Keep him coming. Can't get enough. Oh, there we go. Nighttime just ended or started. I wonder if the frog likes hugs too. She's not ecstatic anymore. Oh, is she actually hungry? Hey, oh. <laughs> I think the frog went to sleep. I need to cook more popcorn for her. Oh, it made three fish. I see. It didn't make anything new though. It just made more. I guess I'll just cook all the popcorn. Especially considering it's pretty much instant. Yeah, it is nice that you can continue to do stuff at night.
I don't, I don't I have no idea if this needs to be watered again, but we're gonna do it anyway. Can I catch fish at night? New fish? Probably, right? Ooh, this one's quick. Look how fast he gets away when I let when I stop reeling. A bay shrimp. Oh, nice. Little shrimp and grits or something, maybe? Quick. Quick to cause stress in the rod and the line or whatever. I guess it's really line stress. Snap the line. Jesus. Come on. Get up here. Ooh, this is a fighter. There we go. Oh, it's another cod. Those guys are hard to catch. I want another squid or something new. I'll take something new as well. Ooh. Easy. Dude, that bay shrimp was so easy compared to the last one. Last one was uh, definitely putting up a struggle. Oh my god, that progressed to red so quick. Oh, didn't. Oh, that one was that one was faking. It was like going to orange and then back and orange and back. Alright, let's go see. Uh I guess I should cook the shrimp. Especially because I have two of them now. See what they make. Ring the bell. Oh, we're already in town. Oh, you're hungry. She fell asleep last time. Oh, that's right. Can't eat the same thing twice. I have to give her fish. I wonder if she likes fine dining. She is a snooty one. Ha! Huh, this is absolutely exquisite. Worthy of the best fine dining restaurants I've been to, and I've been to those a lot. Thanks a lot. Yep. Okay, so she likes fine dining and comfort. She's ecstatic again. She really likes black coffee, though. What's the frog doing in here? Good morning, Sprout. Are you hungry, buddy? No, he's good. I can talk. I can hug him. Come here, big frog man. Bring it in. Wasn't that great? Favorite niece of mine? Jeez, you gotta love the sights here. The sea, the sun, the breeze on my skin. It just feels so right. I'm happy to aboard this ship. With you, my niece. Wish your Aunt Vi Viv could see you right now. Running your own ship, helping out these stranded souls really warms the heart. Glad you picked me up on that island. Try to make myself the least cumbersome passenger on this boat. Except for food. Never stop asking for delicious meals. So does he just eat forever? Is that what he's trying to tell me? He already had cooked fish, so he won't eat that again. Over here. Glad you came to talk to me. Like I said earlier, we needed more people in this boat. New passengers, there's been there's got to be a few people around. Lost like I was, well mean exactly like me. There are a few things that might go unnoticed by most. Probably why father was always suspicious of me and why mom gave me a hard time for it. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Let's cook our shrimp. All right, that's gonna take a while. What are you doing? Why are you giggling? Hmm. Any of our stuff done? Coffee looks like it might be done. Yep. Uh, 
Oh, the corn's done too. And the linen. Everything. Oh, linen's not done. Linen takes longer than everything else. Well, I need more seeds then. Can you cook raspberries? Oh, this was not done yet, was it? Nope. Well. Well. A curious ingredient, neither a veggie nor a grain. Alright, let's put that in again. Right, I gotta pee real quick. I'm right back. I'm going to refill my coffee, too, while I'm at it. guy we find is gonna be like the, the crop guy you know oh, look I came back just in time just in time for the shrimp to be done a shrimp cocktail interesting but can I shrimp can I cook berries yeah wait I didn't give her any food right Give her the shrimp cocktail. It's fine dining. Oh, maybe I could give her a fish. What are you doing, frog man? Doesn't feel like hugging. He's hungry. I just gave him a fish, I think, right? Oh, keep him coming. Can't get enough of it. I think he dislikes nothing and he likes everything. So you, I think you can just feed him over and over and over. And he likes it every time. Poached fruit. Okay, yeah, that kind of makes sense. I don't think you poach a raspberry, but can I, can I cook a log? Wait, I can cook five logs. Surely this makes like charcoal or something, right? Oh gosh. That is a long timer. All right, let's go on. Let's go on to uh, onto town here. Wonder if time passes while you're like standing still. All right, so let's go get double jump. Boom. So I can get the treasure chest that's on the roof and stuff too. I wonder if there's something out here. No.
That is going to be very convenient. This guy. A vibrant necklace. Oh, interesting. And I should probably buy some more seeds from Mr. Venderman. Oh, she's here. Browsing for some fiber. You want a hug yet? You good? She's good. Uh oh, she gets happy when she shops at Raccoon. She's not hungry. I don't need to feed her. You're, you're Stella, if I recall correctly. I never forget a face, especially if they have shiny glimpse. Oh, she already, already talked to him about this. 5,000 for that, man. That is expensive. Stuff is kind of kind of a little, little pricey. All right, well, I'm broke. Hi, raccoon man. What's up? You made it. Wicked moves getting up here. I kind of lied earlier. It's not so great up here. But you're here, so you might as well get better. I don't have a membership card for you. You'll be our honorary member of the upstairs crew. I'll show you the secret handshake, but I don't know where your hands have been. <laughs> oh, thanks, bud. Oh, is this still locked? So I can't get that thing in there. I thought maybe I could get in from down here. Oh, more linen. Right when I just bought some. Yes, young person. Can I assume you're busy? Of course you're busy. Wait a second. You don't have a full service kitchen. Come back when you do. I have quite a pitch for you. Oh, a full service kitchen. Sounds nice. So there's nothing in here. What's the point of being in here? My sister keeps asking me for money. How can I say no without saying no? Maybe I should ask someone to rob me. Hmm. Someone to loan my sister money. <laughs> wow, that's... You're pretty desperate. You're like, maybe I just have someone rob me instead. What is this? Can I, like, jump really high on these if I time it right? Doesn't seem like it. Alright, we're done. Oh! He's got a different shadow! Oh, there's a thing. There's a thing to dive here. Some crystals. Citrine. Hello? <laughs> what is that voice? What? Oh! You gave me such a fright! That cat, he looks familiar. Daffodil? Is that you? Oh, yes! Yes, it is! Ever so silky, aren't you? And that must mean... Stella, is that really you? What a fantastic turn of events! Is that your boat over there at sea? Come to rescue me again, I see. Well, not so fast. This time, I'll be the one doing the teaching. You can bet on it. Let's get going, then. We have some lessons to go through. Okay. Okay, weird person. Off we go. Oh, what is this? It's a sheep. I want your fur. Your wool. Not fur. You don't have fur. Your sheep. You have wool. I guess I need some shears or something. To, uh, to shear the old sheep. Is this person... We are not friends. Okay. Sorry. Apparently we're not friends. Hello. There's gonna be some sc scraggly old lady. Oh, my linen done? won't let me in over here a little one. Oh, stella all this air all this open space yes i feel i can grow quite nicely here look at me i'm flowering already is it a turtle what is this flash bang the snake oh getting out of this crushless what a feeling thank you stella 
could be like, thank you, Stella. Fiber. Um, let's do this. And then a coffee. And then another coffee. Dude, this is not done cooking still? Oh my god. Wait, where are you going? Come back. We need to talk. What? What? Oh, there you go. Oh, Stella, don't you think your boat feels a little sad? Oh, sure could use some greenery. An added bonus, a small garden could serve as a nice classroom. We're thinking about this teaching thing for a while now. We called caring for plants from A to Zayla. Yeah, it doesn't ring as good as one said aloud. Yeah, I need to work on the name some more. I'm guessing your name is Zayla. Let's hug the snake. Aw, you're sweet. Thanks. What kind of food do you like? You like a fish? You want a fish? Oh, thank you. But I'm not hungry right now. Okay. Yeah, well, I tried. I tried. What more can I say? Can I make the garden? Yes. I guess it'll go here. But I have all the buildings I can make. Um, gar gar garden, carrot. Let's do carrot, carrot, turnip. Oh, I didn't water the ones downstairs either. I wonder if this snake person will do watering for me, so I don't have to. What a wonderful little garden you really outdid yourself, Stella. Well. And that makes us just about ready to start the first lesson. Make sure there's some seeds in these plots. They'll be important. I did. Our first lesson will start with something that's been quite excited to share. This world has some strange rules you probably know. Must have always been a, a preacher for love towards all living beings. What is <laughs> What's going on here? Or you see, a garden is a vessel of our love. A mirror we hold to ourselves. This seems truer now than ever. Back on my island when I was lonely, I sang to the flowers, and as expected, they grew much more vigorously. Through trial and error, I managed to write a little song. I didn't seem to react particularly well to it. I want to, uh, I want to further test an observation with you. Go inside the garden and try please playing that piece to your crops. Okay. Hold R to play the guitar. Oh shit. We're jamming now, boys. Does this end ever? Hold on. Music's coming on now. It's just ramping. What is the cat? Is the cat singing? <laughs> I mean, the song is relatively easy. Oh, I say as I fuck up because I hit S instead of A. Whoopsie. The moment you open your mouth, you fuck up. Always how it is. I guess this never ends. As we've been going now for several minutes. I feel like the full the full band is here now. 
I mean, the plants are growing. Oh, it did end. I guess you play it until it grows all the plants? This one... Oh, yeah, I guess they're all fully grown. Have you seen how the plants swayed and grew as you entertained them? Isn't that fabulous? As I suspected, emotions in this world manifest themselves much more vividly. Well, I'll make sure to spread the word about this fascinating discovery. And who knows? Other pastors might know how to play some music, too. That might help. If in a good enough mood. Speaking of which, in all the commotion of the last few days, I forgot something. Here, this is for you. A strange corner has been tickling me ever since I arrived here. Relieved it's not one of those pollen allergies again. Hold on, I gotta go get my cooked wood. It's gonna be, it's gotta be like charcoal, right? Surely. Yeah, okay, I made coal. <laughs> I, that's what I assumed, but I, you know, I wasn't sure. Okay, coffee. Cook coffee in the oven, apparently. At least coffee's like instant. I don't want to overdo it on like spending resources because, you know, my assumption is we'll get advanced cooking eventually, which will require multiple resources. But it might not matter. Resources just might be so abundant that... Oh, you need hold D. I was like, what am I doing? Oh, the turnips didn't finish. All right, turnips. What is it? R? Right? Yeah. This one's for you, turnips. Oh yeah, you can hear the cat meowing. Okay, look how fast it's growing. Is it done? How do I know when it's done? It doesn't seem like it's changed, it's growing. Yeah, it's done. Then I'll plant the other one. And then I need to water it. I need to water the carrot too. Right? I planted these and didn't water them. Oh, the soil changes color when it's watered. It's like darker now. What are you doing awake still? I was recently hugged. Wait, I tried to feed you and you weren't hungry, right? Oh. I've been having unsettling dreams. Wait, I did hug you, right? Yeah. Oh, now you want to talk. I don't want to disturb you with this, but the last several weeks I've been having strange dreams of a giant snake and of a menace and menacing reefs and rotten fruit. Since joining you and your crew, well, they've been much clearer. I think it's the air of the sea or maybe mystical energies of the Everlight. You know, I'm convinced my dreams have been visions. And furthermore, I think they might be coming from our mutual acquaintance. I've been looking at the map in your cabin. My eyes keep being drawn to a specific spot that I marked. I think we should visit. No point in making it wait. All right. So this, this soil is dry, 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 dry. Yeah, I see it changes color from like a white to a much darker brown. Good morning, honey. Oh, it's, it's daytime already. Oh, you don't have to sleep. Interesting. Good morning, Sprout. Quite a few new faces on board. I like it. Don't get me wrong. I just wanted you to forget about your old uncle at all. You know what I mean? I'm a Mr. Personality. 
can't get along with anyone anywhere anytime i just didn't think i'd have to make new friends at my age you don't have to worry i'll be all right sorry i even brought it up just go stand on the edge of the boat and take in the splendor you know hopefully no bugs will fly in my mouth that's no fun you're a frog you eat bugs you're hungry aren't you always hungry though isn't that kind of like your sh your shtick What's this? Something else, please? Oh, I just made, I just fed him fish, so he doesn't want more fish. Poached fruit is a dessert. Coffee is a stimulant. Um, I'll give you a berry. Delicious. I had a hankering for this. Eating a meal he likes. I wonder what he gets for... Oh, now I can feed him fish too, right? I'm working my way towards a snack. Oh, so he doesn't just eat forever. Hey, what's up? You did good. Now we got a real boat going, and you've been, uh... You'll have to take care of these new pastures now. They'll be ones testing your patience, not me. Before all that, I have something to ask you. You might have noticed by now, but sleeping in the guest house is not the ideal scenario for any of us. Especially since it's gotten crowded in there. Look, I'm not complaining, you know. Uh, you've done terrific up to this point. It would be terribly rude of me to blame you for anything. I think time for have a space of my own. A nice little house. Unpretentious, but sophisticated with a cozy vibe. A space in which I could read and unwind. Far from the turmoil of the deck. Oddly enough, I'd see something with uh, an alpine flair. See, even I can be filled with nostalgia sometimes. Anyway, I won't be pushy on this, but I'd be delighted if you could build it for me. Gwen's Lodge. Okay. Come here, frog. Bring it in. Bring it in, buddy. Wasn't that a great favorite niece of mine? Are you hungry yet? No, so he doesn't just eat always, but he does just like, he likes all food pretty much. My chakras are not aligned yet. Are you hungry? You want some fish? Oh, no, 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 Stella, don't you remember? I don't eat any animal product. No breast milk, nor ova. Certainly the way, the way, uh, certainly they were not meant for our consumption. And the meat? No, 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 I'm sorry I won't impose any choice on others, but I cannot eat that. Okay, so she's a vegetarian or she's a, a vegan, I guess, actually. Uh, you want some popcorn? Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. What about you? You want some coffee? Doesn't say she's hungry yet, but maybe she's... That was one da damn fine cup of coffee. I haven't had... Tell you, I, I've had... I can't tell you how many cups of coffee in my life. This is certainly my favorite of them all. Thank you very, very much, Stella. You're welcome. Surprise hug. Mm -hmm. Now she should be a very ecstatic. All right, I guess we got to go to wherever the snake wants us to go. Oh, all the way down here. Quartz dragon. We're going far. A <laughs> nice little boat here, man. We got the, the gang. Oh, that's nice that I can do that in one double jump. All right, what does her uh, what does her house take to build? Oh, I can build it. Gwen's Lodge. Oh, it's uh, it's too tall. Uh, it might fit there actually if I move the garden. Or what if I put the kitchen on top of the garden? Gwen's Lodge right there. I'm coming, frog. A lightning storm. Let's go, baby. Give me some money. I need money. Where's lightning?
I don't have any bottles for this, but lightning still gives me glim, so. Well, it doesn't seem like it's giving me a ton. I guess I can double jump that. I don't have to climb the ladder. Watch out, frog. There's lightning. He'll be all right. Hey, it's really easy here. That's it. Easy peasy, Frogman. Thank you. Oh, look at Stella's little house. It's got nothing on the first floor, though. You gonna decorate it now? Cabin is outstanding. It really does wonders if you have a place of your own. Doesn't it remind you of my old condo on Waverly? Probably the only place where I could get some peace and quiet. Thank you, old friend. Uh, St Stella? Stella, you good down there? What's going on? <laughs> glitching out on the ladder. Uh, I took a look at your blueprint station. It's nice, I suppose, but you know, you could make it even greater. More plans, bigger buildings, better pencils. I'm just saying. I'm sure Albert, Albert Schubert could help you out. Oh, she's not freaking out on the ladder anymore. Got some fiber I bought. I was going to use it to weave some thread for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you now. Do you want it? No. Keep it for my weaving then. Yeah. I don't have a loom though. I need a loom for her to weave. Oh, look at the, look at the soil here. It is dry, dry, dry. I'll fix it. Watering my cat. This soil looks like it's still kind of dark. Oh, no, it's not. I hope someone will do this for me. I don't want to be watering my plants all the time. What up, buddy? This likes non-vegan food. Hmm. Doesn't really say much. Oh, it's, it's go time. Hmm. Here they come again. Uh, I don't feel great. Oh, I still have faith in you. I'll watch from inside. Okay, so it's the same minigame as before. Although I don't think I've made it. I think I'm passing through one of these. Should be slightly easier now that I've double jumped. I say, but holy crap, this one is not easy. Dude, the green ones are up here? I can't get that high. Oh, the big boy. Come here, big boy. Who do I... That's too high! I'm getting scammed! I can't... Dude, that's way up there! Holy crap, that's so high! Oh, no, green boy! Green boy, come back! Oh my god, I missed it. Actually the worst. Let me on the roof. I don't think I can get that one. Oh, I definitely can't get it if I don't get up on the rooftop. That, that event's kind of hard. Oh, it's not over yet. I thought it was over.
Now it's over. That is, uh, not super easy. What's up, Frogman? He's hungry. Did I just feed you a fish? Nope. Our service on this ship is incredible. Recently, Hog's eaten a meal he likes. What else does he eat? I need to figure out what his favorite food is. It seems like he is really just like a... Just a food man. You just feed him everything all the time. I need to cook these things. My radishes and carrots. At the very least, I can give it to the snake. You're not hungry, right? I can't feed you again. Um, yeah. Oh, we're at the thing for the snake. Oh, I can't go in anything. Oh, this. I thought, I thought that might be it. The dragon. I guess it is inevitable it would be here following me always even in this world our destinies well they're intertwined are they not still for all the harm it has done to me it looks quite in pain doesn't it the rocks on its back seem to be oozing with corruption perhaps chipping away at them might soothe it go ahead stella all creatures deserve love and care do your best Oh, this is a, a hold. Oh, it's over here. Ooh, some quartz. Very, uh, explosion-y. I don't know if that's like, I guess that's best swing right there. Da -da -da. Gotta go back the way we came. Blammo, man. What was that? Oh, I think it's nothing. Give me that quartz. Are you better? Did I fix you? Oh, his eyes changed. He looks better now. He looks relieved, doesn't it? I wonder what it means. If we're ever to cross this dragon's path again. I think we should help it. However, I might feel about it. For now, though, I need some time to collect my thoughts. Thank you, Stella, for everything. Hi, dragon. Huh? Has witnessed the dragon from her past. Oh, she's not happy about that. Mm. Come here, little snake. You need a hug. Oh, you're sweet. Not a fan of this weather. You want some food? Oh, wait, it's not done yet. I'm cooking you food. Grilled veggie. Oh, they probably both make grilled veggie then. Oh, you need five carrots? Oh, you can make five at a time. I only made one last time. done already hard to tell like how done things are 
Why did that carrot grow so much faster than the other ones? The coffee's done already. Oh, no, it's not. Got the beans already. <laughs> it's not done, though. Interesting. I figured it would be done. So, are you sleeping yet, Della? Well, I you remember my old sewing machine. It was... It, it was a diva. Gold lettering and a manual wheel. You know, I've always been into textiles. Well, a few years ago, I went to a museum. Tons of different sorts of fabric crafting machines. I couldn't help but notice that you could build a loom on this ship. It could be a great opportunity for you to... For, me to teach you a few tricks, and I'm quite sure that uh, you'll need thread and fabric soon. You should definitely add a loom to the boat. Resources for it should be simple mm -hmm. to find. Just check your blueprint table. I agree. We should build a loom. So you can get to work. I don't think I can build it yet, though. I think I need to go to the arc uh, to the dock. What? Weren't you just... How did you come back out here? Was recently hugged. Oh yeah, here I have grilled veggies for you. Oh, thank you. I was quite hungry. She doesn't get happiness from food. Sag. Oh, this rain. Will it ever stop? This guy likes the rain. Oh, he's a. Uh, he's out cold. He's drooling. We got a drooler. I will go down to the the dock. Oh, my food's done. My veggies. What is that? Oh, and this is the Everdoor. Old Harbor. Albert Shipyard. Oh, and this is new too. What is this? Green Halton Bay. Let's go there. It's like on the way, so. I need to ring the bell. I got bitches. Good morning. It's not done yet. Hmm. Coffee's done. For sure. Um, let's do one corn and one linen, I suppose. Surely the snake will do all this for me eventually. Surely. Ready? What just happened? Oh, I discovered the bay. Yeah, it was very close, so. Uh, I assume I'll just get resources here. It is nice that food doesn't burn. I don't think I have anything left to cook. Maybe more coffee and stuff? Oh, I can cook multiple coffee. Can I cook multiple of everything? Maybe. I'll try cooking multiple popcorn next. Oh, I can. I was making one at a time earlier and that was, uh, hey, that was not correct. You can just make a whole batch at once. Thank you. All right, we have a bunch of meals for uh, Stella. Or not Stella, I'm Stella. Mm -hmm. Thinking about father recently. When I left with Doug, I didn't feel anything. No mm -hmm. sorrow, no hate, no relief, nothing. It didn't really matter to me. It mattered to you. You spent three days crying in Aunt uh, Petunia's room. I bought you three sisters and gave them, gave you that damn oversized sweater I had knitted a month prior. Mum was appalled, but you felt better. I long wondered why you were so sad. What's come with is that you were sad in my stead, feeling things I couldn't feel myself. Maybe. Has a nice house. Oh, she doesn't want a hug. You want some coffee? Okay, I just gave you coffee. So then you want popcorn. 
This is outrageously good. Mm. Common fruits always taste so good. It actually didn't give her that much. I wonder what her dislikes are. Hello, frog. Would you like some food? Some veggies, perhaps? Service on this ship is incredible. Yeah, it's hard to get his, uh... Hard to get his mood up. Wasn't that great favorite niece of mine? You know, you can catch different fish when it rains. Maybe they like to come to drink the fresh water that's dripping down. Pretty neat, right? Oh. Oh, thank you for that information. So I can go fishing now and get different fish. Let's go uh, visit the bay first, though. See what's going on here. Okay, I think you can one-shot that. I think I let go early there. Hello? Hey! Came here to cut down these trees, but I forgot my axe. I can start using someone else's axe. That would be strange. I like the way my axe feels. It's so sturdy and it calms me. Oh, I miss that axe. I've been passing time by writing letters and throwing some in the water. I've been writing poetry. It's not very good, but I'm getting better. Hopefully no one finds my terrible poetry. I'll be picking up some wood. Uh, uh, hoping to do some work on these later. He likes harv- yeah, he harvests wood. He doesn't like to harvest wood, but he does harvest wood. Okay. Are you hungry yet? More fish? Nope, not hungry. So, if I don't cut these down, I wonder if he'll do it. Or if he'll just give me some wood when we leave the island. More berries. Place to dive. Is this going to be some poetry? A ring? There were no treasure chests on this island that I saw. But no! I want to be on the land! Let me on the land! Yeah, there's... I don't see any. This is just wood and berries here. Interesting enough. And some person who wants an axe. What is the point of this? Oh, and copper. That's true. I got copper, too. All right. Interesting. Um. Oh, is he... Maybe he, he might also not be happy enough to harvest the wood. I think he needs to be at least at the green square. I'm not sure. I assume I'll need this linen, so I think it's fine that we have it. All right, let's get out of here. Onward to the dock, the shipyard. Here's another thing. Crates, seeds, treasures, wood, and ores. Hmm. I guess we'll go get the crates. It's on the way again. Might as well, right? Yeah, it doesn't like the rain. I know, I know. I was recently hugged, witnessed the dragon from her nightmares. I just gave you grilled veggies. Um. Did you have poached? You're not hungry. Oh. He's repairing the building. Yeah, he repairs buildings on the boat. Oh. 
quick, jump in the water. There's wreckage. I'm sure you'll find some helpful materials in there. What? Here we go. Oh, this is just dive spots. Okay. One limestone. One copper. Can I get this crate right here? Yeah, I can. Oh, some seeds. Nice. And some logs. Ow, I bumped my head. That's it, huh? Oh, I forgot to go fishing. I meant to go fishing while it was raining. Oops. Any more crates out here? Nope. What about that big wreckage? Alright, well. I guess that's it for this. Oh, we've got some seeds, so that's nice. Oh yeah, and then it despawns. What is this? Looks like a bus. That's Alt Harbor, yep. Yeah. And here's more crates and more jellyfish. Alright. To the shipyard. Need to go visit the guy and upgrade. Frogman is a mess. I like Frogman though. Even if he is a mess. Are you hungry yet, Frogman? I don't know when Frogman's ever hungry. Delicious. I had a hankering for this. Trying to get his happiness up. Him and the, the snake are much harder to please than Stella. Are you hungry? Oh, thank you, but I'm not hungry. She is unhappy. Because of her, her, her little fiasco with the dragon. A sneak hug. Stella never expects it. Doesn't like a tool's banging. Oh, because he was repairing the house. He was repairing your house for you, lady. So what does this mean? Temporary bonuses? Or something? Not sure. Not sure. Oh, we're back at the shipyard already. That was pretty quick. Who are you? What the hell? Jump down. I did. It wouldn't let me. Oh, here. Hello there, young lady. I guess you must be the new spirit fair. Happy to make your acquaintance. I'm Francis. You could say I'm a sort of wandering merchant. See, I'm very fond of things, objects, curios, whatever the last thing he said was. I just buy everything. Simply put, I'll buy anything you don't want anymore. You come across a few valuable treasures already, so tell me. What is it you want to part with? What are errands? Oh, daily quests. Old shoes? You'll buy my old shoes? An old carpet. Dusty but precious unless it makes you slightly dizzy. If looked at for too long, should be sold. Used to find guardians in another life. It no longer has any use. Should be sold. Should be sold. Should be sold. Damn. Man, just made me a bunch of money. Limestone quartz. Broken into silica powder in the crusher. Lime powder in the crusher. Can we fuel the foundry? Can we use it in the crusher to become a carbon powder? Copper ore. Right jelly, lightning bottle, and a citrine. Proof that beautiful does not mean expensive. I'm going to hold on to that. Linen fiber. Maple logs. Here's all the stuff I just sold him. Odd seed. In the garden, it could turn into anything. Hopefully something good. 
I'll buy all your bottles. And I'll buy his one odd seed. I'm immensely chipper to see a dynamic young lady being so hard at work. Not that Sharon wasn't a true professional, but his manners were, well, a bit cold. You know what I mean? He kept everything he found. What a pity. But you're here now. Huzzah! And if I dare say, oh, and don't fret, budding mariner. If ever needed old friends will never be too far. But don't let me be an Im impotent to your appetite for adventure. Go on. Set the sail, little blue jacket. <laughs> I like this guy. <laughs> uh, he's my spirit animal. Plant my odd seed. And my carrot seed. He's got some funky music too. Francis, you're you're blocking my garden. I can't see shit. Francis! Fine, I'll just water everything. Whatever. Go talk to Mr. Shark Man. Made a bunch of money. I spent some of it, but I made more than I spent. Getting your, your mail here for the past month. Not a post office. You need to add a mailbox to your boat. I got one more letter filled with glitter. I'll lose it. I'm warning you. you might be a customer, but I reserve the right to yell at you. Get it done. Okay. A mailbox. I uh, definitely can't make that. Oh, I can just buy the boat. Upgrade. This is very easy to make. The hobbyist. Oh, you can use the mouse here. Well, can't do that. Um, I guess we'll just get the intrepid otter. So the size upgrades of boats only cost money, it looks like. All the way. Only money. Orchard, sheep corral, and a windmill. Oh, I wonder if I can go get that sheep. Planks, thread, and lightning in a bottle. So we need, yeah, we needed this, right? Because we need the salmon and the loom. Opens up a passage on the ice flow. An icebreaker. So if snakes intertwine, makes the boat go faster. Pulverize some rocks. Beautiful flowers makes the boat go faster. Gets any stain out. The mist cleaner 1000. You're gonna have the nighttime makes the boat go faster. Faster. Interesting. Well, we got a bigger boat and we got the next tier of blueprints. Right, they just fired an employee at the popcorn factory. He was a good worker, but found him sleeping on the cob. <laughs> All right, I gotta go. I gotta go after that joke, bud. All right. I can improve something. You can improve the garden. Interesting. You can improve everything? Add lights for your passengers. Wonder what that does. Oh, I can improve Stella's house too. Wall decorations. Okay. Wonder if that does anything. Okay. So we have some new structures. Uh, I need to make the loom. Okay. And then I need the loom to make the sawmill. And then I need the sawmill to make the foundry. Yeah. So now the loom's done. I need Stella to be making cloth. I assume I can make cloth too.
Okay, I see. I assume you want to put it in the middle there? Alright. Cool, I guess. So she'll probably just run the loom for me? Oh, she said she had some fiber that she would turn into um, thread for me. So I assume that's what's going to happen. Assume she wasn't like lying to me or something. <laughs> and when I get the sawmill, the frog should run the sawmill. All right. Wake up, bitches. I need to go somewhere where I can get wood, too. Oh, there's Francis. I wonder what this is. If it's even anything. Oops, let's go over there. Everyone wants to talk. A word, please, Stella. I don't know if you've noticed, but I have been very tired recently. I'm afraid to say it. I'm starting to weigh on my morale. I don't want to sound ungrateful, but I think the guest house, as lovely as it is, might not be very good for me. A bit too noisy and quite cramped. I'd hate to ask you this, but could you maybe arrange for me to have a little private space on the boat? It would help me tremendously. We could continue our lessons, but nothing too fancy. Just a place to sleep and meditate with lush greenery, perhaps. Oh, and I'd be delighted if it had natural stones. Yes, that would be splendid. Thank you. Thank you again, Stella, deeply. I'm giving him Francis's, right? I'm giving her Francis's voice. <laughs> Oops. Her voice was more scraggly. So it'll tell me when it needs water. Oh, maybe that's new because of her? Stella, I've got to tell you. There's something I've stumbled upon some time ago, and up to now I see the important. Brace yourself. Remember my parents' manor on the lake? It is sounds it's not too far from here. Mm. Yes, I know. It makes me wonder about this world too. I must admit, I've been actively trying to avoid it. At any rate, it's come hard to ignore. So uh, much time with you here. I think I'm ready to tackle mm. this challenge. I'll probably only find regrets and sorrows there, but it's worth a shot. Add your relation to your map. Ready when you are. Okay, here's the the bus stop. I cannot go over to the actual bus stop. I'm going bananas on this ship. I don't have anything to do. Got the surplus of energy. I need to get my hands busy. Can you do me a solid? My favorite niece, you know that? I think we need a place to focus on energy. I in a sawmill. Yeah, you're just missing some of the key components, materials. I'm sure you can find on nearby islands. I'm counting you to help me out. I'm sure you don't want your old uncle to sleep on the deck, right? What? You wanted work, not a place to sleep. I don't think this has got a little confused there. Do I have any seeds for this? No. Are you going to work the loom? That would be great right about now. Oh, you're hungry? Uh, you want coffee? Okay. You, you just had coffee. There you go. Sneak hug? No. Oh yeah, when she's super happy, she harvests fiber. <clears throat> but she says she'll use the loom now. What is the point of this ley line thing? It's a bus stop. What do you want, frog? Frout! What's up? You've upgraded your boat! Hmm, that's weird. Don't tell everybody. Left some bolts loose. Probably in just a hurry. Give me a second. Here we go. Oh, mama. That did more than I thought. Let's see here. Oh, this boat's got some advanced options now. First off, you can travel safely and not go through all the dangers the sea has to offer when you're using your map. You just need to toggle on safe travel mode. It's that simple. Don't worry. I won't stay on forever. Every time you select a destination, it won't be on. Hope that helps. What else do we have here? Oh, yeah. The engine's been boosted. Now set multiple destination points. That's pretty handy. Set your course and let the wind do its job. Besides that, it's just a bigger boat with more room. Well, have fun. So now I have safe travel. We don't need that. 
Um, I do need more stuff. I need to go to an island too, though. Cove? We can go there. There's another bus stop. I don't understand what the bus stops do. Let's go here. Crates. To the crates. Hi, bus stop. Oh. Hello, my stomachs. Do you have anything to nibble on? Yeah, I have some food for you. Did you just eat vegetables? Oh. Yes. Um. All right, you can have the poached fruit then. Oh, you found my weak spot. Sweet spot, dear. I can't say no to a dessert. Delightful, sugary perfection. Thank you very much. All right, she likes desserts. Sneak hug. Don't you feel better now? Oh, now she plays music to plants. Nice. What's up, Frogman? Oh, not here. Frogman. What do you got going on? You're hungry? You want a hug, too? A little hug always brightens my day. Here, you want fish? There you go. I still don't know what he really likes. What about you, Stella? Are you good now? Has an improved house. Oh, she's always going to be happy now, then. More seeds. Some empty bottles. These diving spots are... Oh. I, were, I was about to say that they're really good for making money, and then I got limestone. The valuables are really nice. You can get them. There's only one diving spot here, and it was just limestone. What a shit set of crates! I'm hacking mad. All right. Um, I guess let's go here. Wait. How do I set multiple travel points? No, that didn't work. There's set waypoint? Ah, there we go. So you have to do waypoints. Oh, there she goes. I don't know if she's actually making Fiber? I assume so. He's clanging on the building. My buddy over here. She can get mad. He's not even in there though. She shouldn't be mad. I don't think I have anything new still. All right. So the snake likes raspberries or cooked. She likes desserts. So let's do that. Enjoyed a total show of handiness. Oh, she likes that. Yeah, let's do it. I need more money. Give me the jellyfish money. I guess the green things are useful too. They seem like the rare resource from this area. Here we go. Everything's going up now. Oh, stop that. Stop that. Why do you start going so fast? Come here, big boy. It's probably like the more you do, the faster it gets or something. back here. Give me this. Wait, those aren't giving me glimpse anymore. Are they? Yeah, see, I'm not getting any glimpse. 
Oh, there we go. I just got 20. Why did I only get 20? Oh, come here. Stella or Daffodil leave the boat? Did Daffodil get off the boat? All right. I assume we made a bit of money. My fiber needs to be watered. Bada bing, bada boom. What about my garden? Yep, garden needs to be watered too. Okay, how are we doing in here? Oh my god, <laughs> it's like halfway. What a nice little house. What's up, snake? I mean, I guess we just hang out. We can go fishing. Catch one fish while we wait. Coming up on more crates. I do need to go fishing in the rain still. A message in a bottle. Got some more poetry. I wonder if there's special fish in crates too. You know, like fish that like to hang around float some. Another message in a bottle. Look in the water for diving. Oh no, she's playing music for the plants. I got a turnip. I don't see anything. Double check. Nope. Nothing to die for here. Quadruple check. What's up, froggy? You probably want more food. You're you're a bit of an eater. Oh. It's not it does not want food. How presumptuous of me. Sorry, Frogman. What is Stella doing in her house? Got a real look on her face. Um, I need to go. Let's go here. I need wood. Some raspberries would be good, too. Amazing end credit song. Um, how is it? Well, I've been playing for two and a half hours. It seems like it's like, um, uh, what is it? It's like, a. you have these little people who come on your ship and you have to make them happy. You manage a little, a little ship here. You got like different structures and stuff. That's, I like it so far. It's very chill. Very chill. Um, what should I cook? I guess I'll cook some more carrots. I don't remember what... I didn't see what seeds I got. Uh, so far, I also, I'd recommend it. I think it's pretty cheap, right? It's a pretty cheap game. I don't remember. I bought the game a long time ago. I don't remember what I paid for it, but... Oh yeah, nice catch. Just fished out a bottle from the sea? That's not trash. Could be anything in there. Tiny ship, old wine, a baby crab. This could even be trash. Go ahead and crack it open. Okay. How do I, how do I, how do I do that? Yeah, like, how do I even look at my inventory? Is this a thing? Let's just plant more linen. Need the fiber. It looks this the soil over here looks a little dry. Oh yeah, definitely. It's definitely a game you just chill. 
you chill with. Um, yeah, like I was saying, it's just like you manage your little ship and you find people and you help them and then like do stuff for them, give them food and stuff like that. But then they also do stuff for you or they're supposed to. They help out around the ship. And that's how far I've gotten. I don't know. I'm sure there's more to be coming up, but I haven't gotten that far yet, so. We will see. Hello, cat. Let us chop some trees down. Get some berries. Oh, and you sail around too. But I feel like that's kind of obvious since you're on a boat. Picking up some wood. What's up, bud? You hungry yet? You don't want a hug? Do you want some food? Surely. There you go. Is he at the right happiness to harvest wood? I have no idea. It's hard to get his happiness super high. I just need to find what he loves, what his favorite food is. And I guess I need to make him his house too. But he hasn't asked for that yet. He has asked for a sawmill. No, I always forget that this is a hold. Uh, I let go early. And that didn't let go early enough. Maybe you can't one shot these. There you go. Anything out here? No. All right, we're done here. I'm gonna go back. Hey, Frogo, come on, let's go back. <laughs> it's time for nap. Sleep time. All righty. End of the day. Then I got to ring, ring the bell and wake everybody up. Yeah, sounds good, man. I appreciate it. Appreciate the lurking. Dude, Francis is uh, stalking me a little bit. Quit being a creeper, Francis. I guess we'll go over to these crates. Then we'll go, uh, well. Do I have what I need to make a sawmill yet? Oh, I need two more fiber. What is this thing? Let me off. What is this? That just to indicate I've made it somewhere? I guess so. This is kind of like what the treasure chests look like. Not sure. I think it's just to indicate that you've like arrived somewhere where stuff happens. Oh. Everyone's sleeping. Hey, wake up. Good morning, honeybee. That's my name, huh? This frog calls me sprout snake calls me honeybee i need linen what's up snack would be great all right uh i just gave you coffee right nope sneak hug never saw it coming like, it's so easy to keep her happiness up. Because I have her favorite food and stuff. Oh. Got something on my mind. Give me a minute. You want veggies? Oh. Alright. His happiness, I can only keep about where it's at. Can't really get it any higher. One copper ore. Why are we... Wood, bottles, turnips, some more seeds. Take all that. More copper ore. Did you forget? Forget what? 
Yeah, I know. I didn't forget. Relax. Oh. Wonder what this odd seed's gonna even turn into. Oh, the carrots are ready. Yoink. Yoink. Alright. Oh, I only have one more seed. I guess I can probably just play music in front of the carrot. Oh, here's my inventory. A glim bottle. Oh, it gives me glim. Message in a bottle. Greetings from Furugawa. Experience the wonders of the great oak forest and the serenity of the magnificent rice fields available now in Gorena Fields. Nice, I got a brochure. A lumberjack without an ax, crying and sobbing. Old trees aren't feeling the cutting. Will grow old, they said, laughing. Ode to an axe. Key for Stella's cabin. Music. And an opal. So if you hit R, that's how you open your inventory. What's in the oven? Oh, veggies. I didn't, I didn't actually remember what I put in there. Um, Let's cook some fish. I have no grilled fish right now, so. So can I play music for this guy? To get this odd seed to grow? Oh yeah, look, the soil's like shaking. Oops. That was A, not... I hit S, but it was, I was supposed to hit A. Oh, it's done. Seems like once that little sprout thing comes out, oh, what did I just get? Valuable ring, empty shell, old shoe, empty bottle. Now I need to do this. I need all this to make the sawmill. Oh, I'm getting extra now. Or is that because Stella was doing stuff? Right? I don't think I was getting three at a time before. Maybe I was. All right, let's get out of here. All right, let's go to where Stella wants us to go. Which is over here. What's this other thing on the map? Oh, Gorena Fields. Are we going through the storm and the rain? There's lack of power tools in here. Maybe that's something I was talking about. Yeah, that would work. I'm working on it, buddy. Goodness gracious. Here, have a hug. Take it easy, chief. Wasn't that great favorite niece of mine? You want some veggies? He's not hungry. What about you? You hungry? You want a sneak hug? She is maximum happiness. All right, you're fine then. I'm going to leave you alone. Stella, dear, doing good. I see you've been taking good care of your plants. That's good. Hope my teachings are helping you in some way. You know, I used to be quite the little soldier. Mid-Fate State University, agronomical engineer, class of 71. Top grades and a progressive profile. I was hired right away. We're one of those big corporations. We charge a large parcel of land, several thousands of acres. I was to maximize the output of the land assets. Well, that's what I did. Believe me, I did it well. And the field full of transgenic seeds when insects came i doused them with poison and then when the soil turned gray i pumped it full of chemicals great powerful stems grew upon those these grounds plentiful unnaturally enormous cobs but underneath all laid an unfathomable sickness i guess it was inevitable that i met with the dragon then sooner or later okay hmm. Don't you feel better now? 
You want more dessert? I gave you this, right? Oh. Not hungry. Just doing more loom stuff. Um, I guess I'll do some fishing. Actually, wait, no, I can build the sawmill. Shit. I need to build the sawmill after I catch this fish. Don't break the line. Don't break the line. Oh, I wonder in local co-op, local co-op, someone probably plays the, the cat, right? That's probably what it is. One of you is Stella and one of you is the cat. Squid, it's lightning. Rout. A storm! Yep. Let's do it, buddy. I got a bunch of bottles. I'm ready. Okay, that, that did work. It was weird, though. Get up there. Two at the same time. The cat got shocked. I always like watching the cat get shocked. It makes this very silly face. Is it, is it more if you wait? Cause like, watch the lightning's patch gets like more hectic. Yeah, like that. I think that's just to indicate maybe that the strikes, you're gonna miss the strike. All right, I gotta go fishing, raining. I have to build the sawmill too, but I wanna catch fish in the rain. I could also just stop the boat, but. Ain't nobody got time for that. Oh, this is nothing. Small glim bottle. I did get, get I did get a new fish, a, a coal or whatever. Something new. Good done. Let's cook and fish. Mackerel. Yeah, there's a lot to do, uh, Discordant. There's many, there's like, so like each of the little, I don't know, areas or whatever has a bunch of mini games in it. So like lightning was that one, right? And that's how you get one of the resources. And there's like another mini game that I know about where you get more, a different type of resource. And then and it's usually, it's usually like each pasture comes in with a new mini game. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I wanted to build the sawmill. I keep forgetting. Sawmill. Ooh, this is a weirdly shaped building. Hmm, it kind of fits with Stella's house, but I don't think Stella would like this thing very much near her house. All right, let me just, hold on. I gotta move some stuff around. I think it fits next to the kitchen. Right? Yeah. Hmm, doesn't fit there. Um, I guess I'll put the garden here. 
Looks a little weird, but yeah, the sawmill and the kitchen fit real snug next to each other. All right, buddy, I built your sawmill. Are you happy now? Wow. This looks amazing. Thank you for helping me out, Stella. The sawmill is so big. What a beauty. There's just one problem. Now don't get mad. I don't need money to repay you. So they call it a favor. See what I did there? Thanks again, Sprout. You're welcome, buddy. You want a hug? No. You want some food? Probably. I have some fish. Yep, there you go. Oh, he's happy enough to make planks now. I can make some planks too. What the hell is going on here? Oh, we made it to the villa. I was trying to make some, some sawmills. Or make some planks. Like 10? Oh, I see. You're doing it all wrong. Yeah, I, I figured out I was doing it all wrong. Let me give you a hand. When you're cutting the logs, you need to make sure your measurements are accurate. Then you cut. Measure twice and cut. You keep your saw blade steady and on the cutting line. If you don't do it properly, you end up losing a, a pinky or an arm or something worse. Never from the old hammer for good luck. Give it a try now, you rascal. Yeah, I didn't do it right. Where's the cutting line? Oh, there's the cutting line. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Okay, that one was not that easy. I can't use the mouse. This is all keyboard. Dude, I'm, I'm moving too late with the angles. Oh, perfect. Oh, this is giving me a lot of planks. I didn't need to do 10 logs. Oh, well, future proof, I guess. So it's like here, the tip of the, the arrows is where I need to be watching. Oh, oh, dude, I'm gaming. I was like aiming for here last, like the, at the start, but it's the, it's the tip of the, the apparatus or whatever. Oh God, the best sawmill, sawman, saw mill. What do you call, who, what's the person who works? I guess a, like a lumberjack. I just wanted to talk to me. What happened? No, oh, come back here. You were supposed to have a little conversation. Don't you go to sleep. Oh, man, he's asleep. Are you asleep? My stomach is rolling. Would you have anything to nibble on? Uh, dessert? Something else. It still tastes flavors from last time. Okay, well then. <laughs> well, then you're going to get girl veggies. Oh, now we're looking at the stars. What is this? See, there's one constellation here. That's it. I can't talk to her. She's sleeping. A valuable ring. I have two glimmer bottles. So now... Oak planks. Oh, I have maple planks, don't I? I need oak for this. So that's what that... Um, oh, this is for the snake. She wants this house. Oak planks. So I need to go get oak trees. I, I need to move up a tier of wood from maple to oak. Sleep until morning. Now we have to go to the villa as well. Oh, wake up. 
You going straight back to the sawmill? Would you look at the oh no, talk to the frog. No! Talk to the frog! You did great! You're ready to start cutting wood like a champ! Just remember to be careful with the sawmill. Don't want to mess around with the dangerous saw blades just because you got left of wood doesn't mean you should cut your hand off. True. What's up, buddy? You've been chopping up chopping up in the sawmill. I like it. Getting the work done. Learning a new skill. Now you got some materials. Maybe you could build me a house. Let me sketch something real quick. Look, it's nothing fancy. It's pretty basic. Just a few hinges here and a few nails there. And oh, I got some materials uh, to build me something nice. I'm asking not only for me, but for the crew. Apparently, I snore at night. Loudly, according to your friend Gwen. <laughs> All right, hold on. I know you want to go to the thing. What's Frog's house take? Oh, it's easy. Oh, I looks like I did need all those maple planks. Oh my god, it's gigantic! What the fuck, frog? Why is your house so big? I need a bigger boat! Frog has the biggest house I've ever seen in my life. There you go, frog. You got a house now. What's up, buddy? You know, I tend to get hungry. That's just a fact of life. Sometimes when I do, I get hungry for real specific things. Ron Viv would call it a laser-focused tummy. Don't get me wrong. It's like pretty much whatever you put in front of me. I'd like for you to put some effort into this one. I'll give you a shout when I get a craving. Don't ask for anything too extreme. You never know with this appetite. Fair warning, Sprout. He's going, he's going up to his house now. Would you look at that? Perfect sprout. Massive. It's room for little one me. I can't wait to catch some shut eye. Really great. Thank you so much. I won't forget this. What does your house look like? It's empty, right? Yeah. You want a hug? No. What do you got going on, buddy? He's going to be a lot happier now. Oh, he plays joyful music. You hungry? You want some fish? Oh. Yeah, he did. He did want some fish. All right. What about Miss Snake Lady? Are you hungry? Or you want to hug or anything? What do you got going on? Oh, you have not ate. Oh. Not ate recently. You want some? She's not hungry. Does not eat very much. All right. Let's do it, Stella. Okay. Here we are. It's curious. I'm both excited and anxious. I'm starting to have second thoughts. Mm -hmm. As if... Never mind. Let's go. <laughs> Away we go. <sighs> What's here? Dive spot. Always pays to explore. What did I find? Old coin collection. What is that for? I'm gonna go visit this house too. Oh, it's locked. I probably need to actually do the stuff with Stella first. Damn girl, what are you doing all the way over here? Long as since we've been here, been here together, Stella. Seems Jerry has been taking good care of the premises. Always been the best gardener we ever had with us. I has not been home much since father died. Shit, I'm much more emotional than I thought I could ever be. I loved this house so much, as much as I hated it, probably. Look, I don't think I can go in there, even with you. It's just... No, I can't. Go without me, I'll wait for you here. Here's the key. Oh, and Stella. Stumble upon my old music box. Would you bring it back to me? Thanks a lot. And this house has always been a real labyrinth. If you're lost, the you have to follow the light. Good luck in there. I'll wait for you outside. Treasure chest. Old painting and some linen seeds. What's in here? Sneaky hidden door. 
Uh oh. Just a weird path. What? No, go up there. Alright, I guess... Open the door. Ladder. Ladder. Oh, we have to keep going up. Oh, there's a chest right there. Who's that on the balcony? Oh, this is a single thing. Oh, it's so the 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 light shows you what room you're in. So it's really easy to navigate. Oh, I hear a chest. Over here? Right here? Right here? Right here? Oh, it's above me. Oh, you can just jump up there. Old carpet. Loom upgrade and a music box. Who are you? Oh. Welcome, small travel, to my humble palace. Everything I own is of the finest quality. Everything is also bolted down, so don't get any funny ideas. Who are you? Oh. Everything the light touches is mine. Also, everything the light doesn't touch. Yeah, everything's mine. <laughs> oh, there's something on the roof. Fuck. Can I climb the outside? Oh, I gotta go all the way through again. There's a treasure chest on the roof, man. Saw it after I jumped. I can't get up there, though. I need like a triple jump or something? Hmm. Eh. Nope, I can't get there. It's too high. What about this side area? Does the key open this as well? Nope. I guess I'll have to come back here later then. When I can jump higher somehow and I can get into that side room. Found the box? Could you give it to me? Sure. Thank you. I'll hold on to it. Oh, you found something else? Ah, I forgot we even had that. It's an old manual for a golden royale. I remember they had one as first prize in the town's yearly tombola. I've dreamt of having this machine since second grade, but thought it would never let me participate in the lottery. The manual will come in handy. Use it to upgrade for your loom. I, yeah, let's get back to the boat. Forget this place ever existed. Happiness went down because of this. Visit her child at home, doesn't like a tool's banging. He's hungry. Um, did you just have coffee? Yes, so then you can have popcorn. Get comfort over anything else. Here's a sneak hug as well. There you go, and now her mood is perfect again. Alright, see ya. Just gonna leave her on the island. Stella, I... Nah, never mind. Saja is not my forte. Slightly happy the villa is still in good condition. Or is it? Okay, let's change the subject. You may have noticed the improved tab in the blueprint table. Over there, you can add decorative elements to the spirit houses and the stations. It's time to upgrade this loom of yours. Once you get the required resources, go for it. Only way to craft fabric and thread. Go on. Yeah, we can upgrade the loom. Needs thread and maple planks. Alright, that's not too bad. What about your house? Uh, everything he everything is in his house costs something that I like don't have Slate linen fabric what about your house Linen fabric. Oh her her um Other stuff's easy though. It's just maple planks 
I need a better kitchen. I need to go get oak wood too. Um, I'm guessing I'm not going to need maple logs anymore. I can probably just burn them. Listen, look, I need to tell you about Doug. He called me the night father died. Mom was still on the plane and he couldn't talk to anyone else. He was polite, very articulate. We chatted for an hour or so and he cried only twice. It didn't strike me at the time, but he was in a bar. Which is odd for an accountant. He told me father's last words were that he loved me. We never talked again. Got some fire rungs. I need to weave some thread for you later, but if you want, I can give it to you now. If you want it. Oh, mm -hmm. thank you for my weaving then. I don't. Does that mean she's actually gonna give me that thread? Or I don't. I don't know if she's actually gonna give it to me or not. Mm -hmm. Hug the snake. Ah, oh, you're sweet. You have not ate anything in how long? Not hungry. Snake is so happy to please. I gotta go cut some logs. Load them up. We'll do another 10. 10's kind of a lot. Hey, Stella! I'm busy, frog man. Cutting logs. Wonder what the sawdust is for. Oh, I moved too fast. Hold on, froggy. I got five more logs. I wonder what he's gonna talk about now. Well, you get, yeah, I think you, I don't know if it's four every time. Plankwise? Seems like it. Be a lot of planks. All right, done and done. What's up, frog man? You know me, I could always go for a little snack, something salty, something buttery, something with flavor. Oh geez, you know what would be just perfect? Big old bag of popcorn all to myself. Go ahead and heat up some corn. I have popcorn for you, come back. Mmm, that really didn't fill me up, or it did me. Making use of my kids a whole lot. Used to make bags of popcorn on movie night for them. Even with the TV turned up, you couldn't hear the actors talking. The crunching was so loud. It was the only way to calm those little monsters down. Those are terrible kids movies. Wish I was still there. See them laughing. For them to fall asleep on me. Thank you for this popcorn. I was looking at your kitchen yesterday. It's fine. Nothing special. It reminds me of my first kitchen. In my terrible apartment. I didn't know what I was doing in there. So careless with the spices, not enough salt. Always, here's a little something to brighten. Anyways, here's a little something to brighten this mess up. Don't worry, it's not a spice rack. You can actually work for it, but it'll be worth it. Just improve your kitchen with some extra oven space. Your kitchen will be looking just right in no time. Kitchen upgrade. Remembers the old family life. He needs a hug. The frog needs a hug. Isn't that great favorite niece of mine? I just fed you, right? So you're not going to eat more? Yeah. He's happy enough. What up? You know, when I accepted that promotion at Global, I genuinely thought I could succeed. And I almost did. Apart from my sickness, I could have made a difference. Mm -hmm. Then I moved upstate, had to have my piano and my sewing machine transferred, just so I stayed. So I just stayed there to avoid the trouble. Everywhere I went, I ran into the McMillans. Hey. Uh, Chad always wanted me to uh, to get out with him and his friends. I just never happened to trust them. They're douchebags. 
Well, just don't use that. Well, I just don't use that word lightly. All right. Didn't like some people. Kitchen upgrade takes fabric. I need to upgrade the loom for that, which means I need more. Uh, oh, I just need more linen. This needs fabric. What do I need these planks for? Guest house requires fire glow, whatever that is. All right, I need to go make some fabric. You do not get much fiber from this. Bing, bada boom. I mean, I guess you get a lot of thread though per fiber. It's three per. I needed this to upgrade the loot. Yeah. Bam. I don't have that many, um, whatever. Limbs. Everyone's snoozing. So now I can make linen thread. Let's do 10. Let's see how much this makes. Oh, look, the little thing's a lot smaller. That wasn't perfect? Is this perfect? Ooh, I don't know. That one was perfect. Okay, that one gave me three. Seems like the the spot for a perfect craft is a lot smaller now. I was hitting it every time on the fab on the on the thread. Not edit. Full potential of yum. Okay. Done. And then I should go to do her upgrades too. Fully improved Gwen's Lodge. Achievement get. I think that's all I have, right? Yeah. Okay. Bedtime. should be pretty happy now that her house is fully improved. Oh, I can interact with my cat? Hi, kitty. Wake up! Looking good. You got that done quick, Sprout. Thanks for taking the time. A good kitchen is a good investment. You'll see. You won't regret it. I promise. Well, my stomach either. Thanks. Big stove. Ah, two ingredient cooking now. Medium sized fish. Large fish. I can do that? What does that do? Yep. Two ingredient cooking. About to get a little spicy. All right, what is this? Brilliant. Now the loom is fully useful. Of course, many stations can be upgraded. You just have to find the blueprints for them and the materials, of course. Stella, I believe it's time for me to teach you advanced loom techniques. Yes, it's a thing. Your improvements you can make to the machine itself depends on how you place your hands on the machine. How you arrange the threads as you load it up has a big impact mm -hmm. too. You simple tricks, you'll be able to craft is craft much more intricate items. Fabric, actually. Here, let's take a look. We can finally craft fabric from thread. Already did though. 
Way ahead of you, sister. Already been there, done that. Yeah, I might need to get some more seeds here. Are you ready to eat food yet? Another treat. A dessert will always cheer me up. Just don't tell my teeth. There you go. Slightly happier now. I need to make her house badly. She is hard to please. Stella is easy to please. And the frog? He's not too bad. He's happier now that he has a house. Oh, he's hungry. I think I just fed you fish, right? Oh, nope. Now he's not hungry. Okay. I'll just leave that alone. All right, let's sail somewhere. Time to get moving. Let's go to the, um... The place with... I think this is a border. I think I can't cross this. Go down here. Fields it says there's oak and rice down here. New ingredients. I think it tells me when things need to get watered if the if the snake is happy. All right, Discordant, have a good one, man. Thanks for hanging out. Catch you later. Have a good sleep. Snack would be great. You're hungry. I think I just gave you coffee, right? Oh, she'll always take coffee. I think I keep giving her coffee and she keeps taking it. I don't really need to do anything with her. I've got some fiber I bought. Doesn't he weave it? You want it? Sure. I'm tired of her asking me about it. Doesn't seem like she's actually going to do anything with it. So I'll, I'll do something with it instead. Your, all your resources multiply big time in this game. Right? One fiber makes three thread. And then one thread makes two to three fabric. Although getting a perfect is much harder on this, I feel like. I can get it sometimes. Oof, that one was bad. Mm, those are a little late. Okay, that one was right on. Late. You're natural. Why am I not surprised? You've reached a pro level now. There's nothing more I can teach you on this subject. Being said, if you don't mind, I'll give it a go myself. It'll definitely help me unwind a bit. Oh, no. Ow. Where did she get happiness from? Oh, has access to a loom. Happy to have shown me around the loom. Got a lot of plus happinesses. Entered the fields. Garena, Garenu fields discovered. Oh, wow, says the frog. This looks like it needs to be watered. Eh, maybe not, though. What do you got going on? She's good. Doesn't have anything she wants. What's up? He says, oh wow, and he has a thing, but I can't actually talk to him. What? Oh no, it's Stella who has a thing. Mm -hmm. Into the curve, are we? The house looks so much better. As if everything had been designed with my happiness in mind. The textures, the tones, the coziness, it's perfect. Look at you listening to me, building such a nice cabin for me. I won't forget this. Stomach is rumbling. I see you got some equipment in your kitchen. You got tools to feed an army. I need a little pick-me-up. Someone keep me going for hours. Some pork chops, maybe? Thanks, my kitchen's my spice. Mark back home. I could whip something. Don't know how it's possible. You just make it up as you go along. That's 
That's what cooking is. Lying that doesn't come back to haunt you. Wise words that you great grandma once told me. What a lady. Oh, I learned pork chops. So what did I get here? Oh, I got a bunch of stuff from that. That was only from one fish. Oh, you can cook sawdust. Well, I learned how to make pork chops. All right, well, let's go visit this island. I need the wood and stuff that's here. I think it's going to have rice, too. More cooking. Oh, a visitor. Uh, welcome. You're here for our world-renowned Porogawa tours? Of course you are. You're holding my brochure. Tour is about to start. It takes about five minutes and covers the history and flora of this island. After, you'll be able to tell all your friends about it. Don't worry, there's no gift shop after this tour. Ready? Sure. Let's start right away. As you can see, I didn't get many visitors. People tend to focus on big city attractions. Here it's peaceful and quiet. It's something you'll notice with the fauna. Rice patches and healthy forests are its main attraction. Moving on. Step off, please. What? Over here. Rice production here is quite incredible. Workers harvest around the clock to feed local families. Right now, no one is around. I am not sure why. Sometimes uh, play in them when I am off duty. But that's besides the point. Ooh. Off to our next stop. Look at these trees. Don't get too close. All right. You can feel the humidity. I mean, really feel it. The oak forest really gets to me. We have a connection, a strange connection. I tend to skip this part of the tour, to be honest. You can move along, that would be great. Okay, I'm gonna chop your tree down, though. Yoink! Give me that oak. Give me this oak, too. More trees. I need this wood. I was say, this looks like something harvestable. Some mushrooms. Tortured hmm. tree is the centerpiece of the whole island. We're not sure when it was first planted. More on the world travel here and leave little messages. Anything to help with their lives. Cool. All right. Hmm. We'll lose our tour. Uh, Orogawa Tours is great for your participation. Thank you for your ears and your patience. Thank you again for your presence. I'd like to leave a tip. Now would be appreciated. We're something along the lines of 50 glims. Okay. That's amazing. I knew I struck a chord with you. I'll sign up. I'll sign you up to our upcoming uh, tours newsletter. You have an educational great time. Thank you for your kind spirit. All right. I gave him a tip. I can't put a, a thing here. A sheep. Here's another sheep. Ooh, strawberries. That's new. Uh, something to dive out here. Of course there is. Oh, it looks like there's something more further to the left. Another sheep tree. I need, like, the triple jump or whatever to get up there. Another place I can't reach. I need to build my, um, my sheep fold. <laughs> Indeed. So I can't get rice? Oh. I'll be picking up some wood. Hope to do some work on these later. I can give him stuff? On canvas, should be sold, should be sold. What can I give him? His shell. Still smells pretty bad. Empty shell. Who would want an empty share shell? Considered a veggie when used in the kitchen. Natural root veggie of the day. Considered small berries when cooked. 
fish. Oh, this is fine dining and soup. And it's a regular sized meal. Can I give him one of these? That's okay, Stella. Did he, does that mean he, did he take it? I think he didn't want it. Yeah, he didn't want it. Um, he ate recently, so I don't think he's going to want more food. Delicious. I had a hankering for this. Okay. Or he did want it. Get up some wood. I hope to do some working. Yep. All right. Bye. I don't know why I can give him food. Also, so I can't get rice? I don't see anything that looks like it's interactable. Hmm. Thank you for taking the tour. Don't forget to tell your friends. All right. See you later. Darn. So no rice. I was hoping you could get rice there. That'd be cool. A new, a new ingredient. Oh, look at all these new islands down here. Greats. Mount Toriyama. Awashima countryside. Oh, and this... Look, this one's lit up. This bus stop. Let's go visit... My buddy here. Who wanted to talk? Stella did. Alright, hold on, Stella. I gotta get some... Something out of the oven. Okay, so I made more of the same. So are these all considered... Small fish, crustacean, large fish, small cephalopod. Oak log. What is salt? What is. Alright, let's cook some sawdust. I don't know what the hell that's gonna do. What's up, dude? You got a quest for me? Maybe we could even trade. I'll give you some useless objects. Alright. You give me your Sasha, I'll give you mine. Just the thought of new careers make my head spin. I've, ne I've neatly organized my stock in errands. Take a look for yourself. Oh, I got the errands now. Oh, he has four odd seeds. I'm gonna buy them all. I have some stuff to sell too, so. Ooh, old coin collections worth a lot. All right, well, I bought four odds or four, four seeds or whatever, and I came out with more money than when I started with. Sure. Your errands. Find and collect. Poached fruit. Grilled fish. Grilled veggie. One of each. Okay. I can do that. Oh, he's gonna give me uh maple syrup for the other one. He wants a sole and a sockeye salmon. And he'll give me a thousand whatever and two maple syrup. Well done! Complete you your first errand. What a great haul. There's plenty more to do if you ever feel like it. I'll always be around. Okay. What do you want, Stella? Or whatever. Look, Stella, I... I'm sorry, I think I just need some space. Just a bit of time by myself. No going to that villa was a bad idea. Sorry, this has nothing to do with you. If nothing went great since you found me on that island. I just need to be alone for a little while. Okay, she's getting real moody. About everything. Do I need these oak logs or anything? I'll just do 10. Oh yeah, these are these are a little rougher to cut. The lines aren't as straight. Oh, I missed a little bit. This might I mean these aren't that bad. Oof, I say and then I completely fuck it up. As per usual. I don't remember what I needed these for. I think the light curves are the hardest. Whoa. Oh, shit. <sighs> Am I getting gray? I've always been getting gray. What's up, Alex? I'm very salty. 
There you go. I mean, it, it, it looks weird because of the lighting, but yes, I have lots of gray hair. What was I doing? Oh yeah, I want to see what can I do with these oak planks now. A new resource. Oh yeah, I needed these for the snake's house. Dude, this thing does not fit anywhere. Hmm. At least I have lots of it, uh, I guess. Is that a good thing? going on here oh uh, nothing fits anywhere I guess the loom goes here Can, does this fit in this space no is this possible fit up here oh it does oh then maybe i can fit the snake's house shit i don't know if this is possible i could be bald i mean that's true it's true you know you got a point there could be thinning and then you know that's it right it's all she wrote at that point dude what the hell doesn't work i need a bigger boat oh I, no i've made it work nice it looks ugly but i made it work all right we did it all right snake lady's got a house now can give her a crystal table. Needs leaks for this. And some logs. Good thing I didn't get rid of all the logs. Aluminum. Ash plank. Ash is the next here. Needs slate. Did I like Frank's music or whatever this guy's name is? jamming sleep until morning I am hungry I have ate nothing today all right where are we going I want to go here why is this why is this bus stop lit up? Oh, also, what is... Wait, what's the weather that we're currently in? What is this? Can I catch some new type of fish here or something? Holy crap, we are schmoving on the sea. Break the line. What is going on? What is this music? Who the hell are you? Welcome to one of my famous bus stops. I found them. I found them. They're mine. All mine. My name is Alex. It's a beautiful name. The best name. Hey, Alex, I found you. You're kind of green, though. Don't, but don't call me Alexander. Blech. It's a garbage name. Garbage name for garbage people. Where was I? Oh, yes. I guess one of the devs was named Alexander. And the other, and the other day, the other, like one of the other devs made this character or something. <laughs> I'm Alex and I'll be your bus driver. 
I wasn't always a bus driver before I was an accountant. Numbers were my shame. And taking you places is my goal. Choo choo. No wait, that's a train. This is a bus stop and I'm your driver. Wanna go somewhere? Music? You don't like my music? Really? You want me to stop my wonderful music? No. Do you does that mean Ah! It was a prank! Good one! I can just go to any bus station? Interesting. This is all we do? Okay, goodbye. Goodbye, you're weird. Um, I guess we're gonna go check out the other islands too. I'll hit the crates. I might as well hit the crates while we're out here. Bye, Alex. Alex the seal. Oh, look, he's cutting up stuff in his own, in his house. He's even wearing safety glasses. Good job, buddy. Oh, I bought the odd seeds, but I never planted them. That carrot, oh, is ready to be pulled. I was like, that carrot looks like it needs to be watered. And it does. It does need to be watered. If it were to be growing. All right, well, the snake should be much happier now that he has a house. Oh, I got a leek seed. Oh, iron ore, nice. We're smithing now. What did I make? Oh, I put sawdust in, that's right. Sawdust makes coal? That's wild. So I've already tried veggies and, and fish. Yeah, what about veggies and grain? Let's do three and three. Or not veggies and grain, fish and grain. Maybe make like uh, fish and chips or something? Nothing down here. All right, on to the next set of crates. I guess we'll go back to the these ones inside this green area. I don't know what that green area is. Oh, how wonderful. Incredible, Stella. Wood, plants, even all, all natural room for meditation. You really outdid yourself. How well I'll sleep in that hanging bed. Yeah, so back to full health in no time at all. And maybe, listen, I have a favor to ask of you. It's become obvious to me that I need to take better care of myself. Let the body listen to the mind. To that end, I need clarity. I need power and energy. Positive minerals are what I'm missing right now. Stones and crystals are connected to the world in an elementary level. Just as the moon is dark and hidden from the sun, living beings wither when their Tulric link is severed. So Stella, what do you say? You could give me some gems and minerals to throw up my cabinet? Three of them should be enough. If you for nothing, you'll see. I'll teach you about the interesting properties of each one you bring me. What kind of things? You want stones and minerals? An empty sh shell count? Thank you, but I don't want that. Okay. You want a quartz? Thank you, but I don't want that. What's a mineral? You mean like gems? Like a citrine? Oh, is that a piece of citrine? Did you know that citrine promoted motivation and activated creativity? Also heard that it encourages self-expression and enhances concentration. True mind revitalizer and emotion balancing stone. Uh, what else do you want? I don't think I have anything else that she would want. She wants gems and crystals. 
Hello. Again. I think I actually got something to sell you. Do you have anything new? It's got two more seeds. Thank you. Or it's a nebula fragment. Or, or fabric, sorry. Right, jelly. Alright. Can I just give her a bunch of citrine? Oh. Citrine, amethyst, diamond, hematite, and opal. A tool wants pork chops. When just we need to wait for her to feel better. I'm thinking. Okay. Pork chops the way to my heart. I don't have any pork, buddy. He's hungry. Um, you want some this? The harvest on their ship is incredible. There you go. He's happier now. He wants a hug too, though. There you go, buddy. Little hug for the road. Now he's happy. I got planks. You got planks? Planks, get your planks. We need some planks for you. Enjoy. Gave me one plank. Okay. Thanks, I guess. One whole plank. Anything else in the water? No. Okay. Oh, my head. What is the green stuff on the map? Like, what is this? I don't know. Something for fishing, maybe? Maybe all the areas are... No. Certainly not. I don't know what it is. Oh, it tells you, like, blueprint chests and stuff. So what about up here? Maple? A shrine? A spirit? A rare chest and a sheep. Oh, I see. So the... If the circle's empty, you've, you've done it. If the circle's there, then it's available. Okay. How come this crate's not doing anything? That has nothing. Copper, maple, and raspberry, all available. And the places I haven't been, obviously, we don't know. All right, let's go grab these crates. I didn't, I didn't hit travel. I hit nothing. Wait, there's something on the map up here. Oh, the, the island. I don't think I can get up there. I have no idea, though. There's a border, and I assume that border means something. Fish curry. Oh, nice. Come on, buddy. Remembers his old family life. Unhappy about it. Where's the snake? I need someone to water my plants for me. Nobody should be in the guest house anymore. Hmm? Time to go diving. Oh, there's the snake. Iron. More leek seeds. Apple seeds. Interesting. Oh, for the orchard. I can't build that yet. What? The dragon found me back home. I knew I had to leave. I felt I wouldn't heal unless I left. I didn't know it then, but I needed love. And 
No love was to be found in this accursed place. But in my exile, I met your aunt. I've never seen anyone as joyful as Rose, filled to the brim with uncontainable life. Remind me a lot of her, Stella. She nursed me back to health little by little. Without her, well, Dragon would have taken me. Right there, I'm sure of it. I never would have met you. She taught me not as one normally teaches, but uh, by opening my eyes to what was already within. To the rich interior life, unsquashed by the dragon, unsquashed by my father. To the interconnectedness of all things, to the, to the universal love, this immense debt I owe her. Well, maybe that's why I feel I need to teach you. Okay. She's hungry. Here's a hug. And then I will give you some food. Do you want poached fruit? No, you just had poached fruit. So she likes dessert. No, she likes... No, she won't eat that. She won't eat any of this stuff because it's all... I wonder if she'll drink coffee. Want to shrimp? try coffee oh thank you I was quite hungry all right she doesn't care about coffee okay so that was not that was not a good use of my uh, resources to give her that coffee Not worth, for sure. Now we have new something new. Rice seeds. Oh, we can actually plant rice now. Let's play right, my rice a little song here. I wonder if you can play music for more than one patch at a time. I guess you're trading like time here for growing your crops. Although I don't feel like this game has like strict time management in it. Take as long as you want to complete it. No downside. How do I know when it's done? I think it needs to grow one more phase. There you go, it's done now. Oh, now it's affecting the other crops in here. So I can grow a whole structure of crops without having to move. That was nice. Very convenient. Um, let's do double rice and then coffee. And I'll leave. I'll leave these alone. I'm not gonna play music for them. These guys, though, get out the old guitar. It's time. Play a little tune. So it'll it'll yeah. We'll auto stop playing though when it's there's nothing left to grow. I really like the cat meowing in the back. I feel like you kind of have to play music for these. It seems like they take so long to grow. Like, even with playing music, this one's still... Okay, just finished.
I should go back to the shipyard and see what I need. To make like the sheepfold and stuff. Although, hey, I need to upgrade my ship size. There's no way I can fit any more structures. Not done. Excuse me. Valuable ring. And an old carpet. Wow. We weren't done. This stuff definitely takes forever, dude. So she'll also stop, I guess, at a certain point. The music just stops, even if it's not done. I wonder if they'll teach me a better song. The snake said some other people might teach me more music. Or I wonder if Stella will teach me the, um, like that song that's in her music box or whatever. Would make sense. These odd plants, man. If it was a normal crop. It would definitely be grown by now. It is getting there, but still not there. All right. Now it's growing the right one instead of the left one. I just want to finish these so I can grow like leeks and stuff. <laughs> I wonder what the empty shells are for. Again. We can compare how fast the leek grows. Compared to the other stuff. It hasn't sprouted yet. Oh, there it goes. I wonder if the effect is constant or it gets like stronger. Also, I wonder if it matters how precise you are in the song. I would think it actually probably does. This leak is not growing very fast either. Maybe the water's not? Maybe the soil's not watered? Ooh, I, how did I not miss that S? I hit it so late. Other one grew. Oh, because the music went over there. Oh, 
Come on, bruh. Let's finish growing, please. Alright, we got leaks. Yeah, none of the soil's watered here. Alright, I'm done playing music. It's like three or four times in a row or whatever. Hey, it's morning. Played music all night. You're welcome, fellow boat passengers. Trying to sleep? Nope. Music. There you go. I have everything built. Okay. Let's go. I mean, I guess I, I might as well go to these islands, right? Before I go back to um, the shipyard. Because they're right here. What up? Proved house, recently hugged. Do you want some food? Not hungry. Right, so what does leek count as? It's a vegetable, right? Yeah, tasty root veggie. Putting a leek is a classic and can last for hours. True. Actually true. Oh. I can make two different veggies together. Leeks and mushrooms. Yeah, I hear someone playing music. Mount Toriyama. All right, let's go. Oh yeah, so it's, where is Stella? Oh, her doors are locked. She's in our room, but it's locked. Or in her house or whatever. House, room, or whatever it is. Hello, sheep. Another place where there's another sheep. Nothing here? Let's climb up. Hello, random person. Oh, you're an actual person. Oh, hello there, young lady. How are you doing? Oh, yes, right. Perhaps you can help me. I must have stumbled upon a fluffy sheep on those... On the loose down there, I tried getting it back to its enclosure, but the stubborn creature wouldn't listen to me. Chances on your side, its weak spot is gluttony. So definitely follow anyone who could feed it. Would you be a deer and give it a try? Okay. How's your house locked? Oh, you have a chest in there! Let me in your house! Mine? Actual mine. Really? I think I didn't hold it long enough. Oh, coal. Oh, there's something up there. Copper. Really? Is that not long enough? Yeah, okay. I keep getting a little, uh, a little scared. Oh, I can't ride this current. I guess I need something special for that. Oh, okay, so it glows very briefly white, like bright white. There. Really? So that does this, so that's not enough. So you can't one shot these. I think you just can't one-shot him. Yeah, I, I'm gonna go with you can't.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shut up. Late as possible without failing. Oh. I got an opal. And an apple seed from my orchard that I don't have. Where's the point of this? I can sit here, but my cat doesn't know how to get up here. Okay. Another fortune place. I don't know what to do with the fortunes, though. Oh, there's... I didn't even see this chest right here. Oh, another citrine. So I need to feed the... Feed the sheep. Where's its thing? Oh, there you go. All right, it's fine. Let's lead it to the enclosure next to the pier. Or follow me. I'm going there. Oh, okay. Oh, what a nice sheep. It followed you all the way to its home. Always following your stomach, aren't you, little guy? He, my sons were just like that. I think it looks lonely. Maybe that's why it left. I'm going to keep it company. Don't worry. But maybe. Well, you found another stray sheep. You could bring it back here. We could entertain each other. Well, it's not too inconvenient for you. Oh, I'm Alice, by the way. Very nice meeting you. She is a actual person, though. She's got a background. All right, well, I guess we're done on this island. Unless there's another stray sheep on this island, but I I didn't see one. I doubt it. My food's done. My leek and mushroom food. What happened to you? He's hungry. You want some fish curry? Delicious. I had a hankering for this. You have a hankering for anything. You just like food, which I can respect. Mushroom salad. Seems like something you might like. You like mushroom salad? Salads are just wonderful. Fresh and healthy, simple, tasty. I love them very much. Thank you. She likes salads. It's not her favorite food, though. Jeez, what is your favorite food, lady? I think his is pork chops. Anything else I need? I don't think so. Oh, maybe I can cook something with the rice? What is rice? It's just a grain? It's just a grain. You can make flour, though. What about rice and shrimp? Crustacean and grain. All right, let's travel to the other place. It's like right here. What is this? What is that? Quarry. All right, let's grow here first. The countryside. Lots of stuff to explore in this game. You're thinking? Yes, pork chops. I know, you want pork chops? You've told me. More valuables. Nice. Oh, those are veggie seeds. I thought those were odd seeds. But they're just a random veggie, I guess. Coffee, rice, and rice. It's interesting that all these things are like interchangeable from a cooking standpoint. It makes things, it makes it simpler. Less complex of a system. Almost done. Uh, are you hungry yet? Probably. He'll usually eat. You want a fish? Nope, he's not hungry. Stella is non-existent. Oh, 
I went right by Franklin. Or Frank, whatever. Something. Food done. Iwashima countryside. Huh? Looks pretty flat. Not sure what we're gonna find here. Southern boil. Oh, a southern boil. Okay. I mean, that makes sense. A small cephalopod with rice. What does that make? Time to go explore the island. Well, let's roll. Mushrooms, yoink. Can't read that. Is there really like a triple jump? It has to be. Or maybe something that just makes your jump higher instead of a triple jump. Can I grab the lanterns? No. So like this one, I can probably, yeah, jump on that. I wonder if there's like a glide maybe. Mm, maybe there's like a glide. Really about, uh, spinning is the talent you need. You know? It takes real skill to find a target, aim, and hit a bullseye. At that skill and raw talent right there. I just love that I'm good at something. Okay. You do you, man. Spit off tall buildings forever. On the off chance I might hit someone right in the head. I seem to never run out of spit. Small bridge isn't very high up, and nobody ever swims down there. Feels pretty satisfying to spit. I'm fully equipped. I've got my mouth, got my bottle of water. I'm ready, and I've got... The spirit to do it for years. Okay. Those guys are interesting. What is that? It's like an owl statue up there. Look at all these trees. Yep. Alright, frogman. Good luck. I wonder if you don't need to cut them down if he's here and happy. They'll just do it for you. Strawberries. Another tree. Oh, and there's mining to do here. This place has a lot of resources. Is this a mushroom? Nope. I always fuck it up. That's it. Just a little resource island. Just, you know, good. I assume we'll need these. Hi, Frogman. See you on the ship. Maybe any mushrooms I missed or anything? Is this gatherable? Nope. Mushrooms seem pretty rare. Pretty rare. Hey, what's up, bud? Why don't you fish anymore? It's really calming. That's lying in your weight. It's so relaxing. It's a fight for your life. You give it all your heart. What's not the love about it? He's upset because I haven't fished recently. There's another area, weird area. Let's go see what this is. I guess I can take the bus stops too. Oh, my food's done. What'd I make? I got it. Rice and octopus? Fried calamari? No. Fish curry again. Fruit doesn't go with anything. Hmm. This is just a fruit vegetable leak. a veggie but these are all root oh, so this is this is different this is a veggie not a root veggie let's see let's see if that makes something different and I'll do some fishing cuz cuz frogman is upset is sad cuz I haven't been fishing lately I got you fam I'll do a little fishing for you
the hell? This one is a fighter. Dude, what the? Did I catch this fish? So this is an eclipse, it looks like. How very, uh, how very topical, since there was literally just an eclipse. It's done. seem for me for anything for me to be done doesn't seem like there's anything for me to do okay so it is the same thing or whatever I don't think there's much of anything left for me to cook I'll just keep cooking sawdust nothing in the water it looks like maybe this is a fishing spot I'm gonna go fishing Everyone's asleep. I need to wake them up. Wake up, bitches! No, I didn't mean to rewater that. Come on, brah. My veggies do not seem to grow very fast. Wake up. Morning, Sprout. You know, I have any idea where we are. Oh, he made me another plank. That's nice. I don't like this. Should I stop? No. I don't like this. This area? I mean, this is an eclipse area, I guess, is the, the thing. I don't know what the point of this is, though. Might be for a character that I don't have yet. That or I can catch new things here. Okay, a soul. Fine. I don't think there's anything new here. Based on my one fishing throw. How long could it stay red? The squids are trolls. They flash it. Like toward red, but never makes it to red. Oh, a valuable necklace. Nice. Seems like it can stay red for a while. Okay. 
I wonder if there's fishing upgrades. Squid. You can tell it's a squid because it does the thing. Alright. I don't know what this is. It's something weird. Oh. Nebula pill bugs. What? Where? In the water? I don't see anything in the water. Where you get nebula fiber though. I'm just going to assume I don't have whatever I need to get those. Let's go to this quarry next. While we're sailing, I'm going to go pee. When is Stella going to come out of hiding? Oh, I guess she's done? I don't have a thing for her anymore. <gasps> the quarry. We do have this. One swoop, two sheep. Mount Toriyama. Oh, maybe there was another sheep on Mount Toriyama then. Okay, I wasn't done yet. Oh, here's another. Oh, another shop. Uragawa. Rice, leek, apple, pork. There's another quartz dragon. A lighthouse with more shop. Tea, lettuce, cherries, opal, linen seed. Mount no, there's only one sheep here. A lot of chests, though. And some question mark, question marks. And one spirit. So it tells you there's a spirit that you can help. Interesting. Crates. A sheep there. Got the spirit there. Yeah, we need like the triple jump to get to that stuff. All right, we're here. Let us go forth. Onto the island and adventure. Yoink. Gotta thoroughly explore. I'm still not convinced you can't one-shot these. I mean, like, I'm telling myself you can't because I'm, you know, coping. Like, you know, I'm definitely not fucking up. You just can't one-shot them. But I'm not convinced that's actually the case. Oh, wow. Three shot that one. So I did really bad. Or it's just a tougher material slate. Oh, hello. I think I'm supposed to train that guy over there. I really don't feel like it. I've been really tired over the past week or so. Can't sleep at night. Hope he gets the hang of the job without my help. My first day on the job. No idea what I'm doing. No one is training me. Place is falling apart. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, I two shot that slate. 
So you're supposed to be able to do something with these ropes. I can't interact with them. Grapple them or something? Zip line? They're glowing like they're like, hey, interact with me, but I can't do anything with it. Held it a little too long. Unfortunate. My iron, thank you. Okay, let's go the other way now. Who are you? All right, all right, uh, you got to get it together, Gregory. This is your day. Today is all about digging. Any problems you have, leave at the door. This is a new day, big breath. All right, Gregory appears to be having a bad time. <laughs> Struggling. Like, is that different? The gap right there. And also, I hear machinery. Oh, there's another vent. I think you're going to get a parasol eventually. You can use these vents to float upwards. Go up top. Mm -hmm. My manager's really stressed out. He told me to be quiet today. I'm going to be talking to you. Mm. If you don't see the sun, you can imagine it's always noon. That's what my boss says at meetings. What? Doesn't seem like a great idea. Iron? I'm getting a lot of like stuff that I just can't do anything with yet. Management is coming today. I better make a good impression. Try to my business face and all. Hopefully they notice me and all this darkness from this mine to the boardroom. Moving on up. Hell yeah, brother. Go get them. Some books here. Oh. So I can't get to the top of the island because I don't have like a parasail or whatever. Parasol? Not parasail. Well, I guess we're done on this island then. There's also like those zip lines that I don't seem like I can do anything with them. These things? They're even glowy. But I can't, like, E doesn't do anything. I can't interact with them in any way. So. Yeah. Something I don't have access to yet. Whoops. <laughs> Missed my exit. Over here. And then down and right. Bada boo! Alright. We're done here. Weird little island that I can't do anything on. All right, let's go to a bus stop. Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Waypoint, waypoint. Okay, let's go visit the uh, vendor. What did I make? Charcoal, right? Yeah. Made some coal. Oh, can I mix coffee with anything? No. Coffee's just coffee. What up, brother? Oh, here's one. It went away. Trippers here, blah, blah, blah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Same thing as before. Any 
We have an odd seed and 12 bottles. Thank you, sir. And more, I want to sell you stuff. Ooh, baby, I am loaded. Do you have any errands? Carrots and turnips for lettuce? Okay. Sockeye salmon. I don't have that. Bright jelly. Oh, I need to go get bright jelly. Coffee beans and corn for tea. Oh, interesting. See you later, Franklin. Or Francis, sorry. Whatever. Got a name, it's something. Yeah, so that nebula thing jumped out of the water, but there was no interact with me or anything. I didn't know I don't I don't know what to do with it. Um, I guess I'll replant my linen. I don't know. Always growing stuff. Here we are again. Back to the craziness. Yeah, I want to go back over here. Thanks for the fast travel, Chief. Oh, too dark. <laughs> Am I gonna have this music the whole time? I need to hit one of those, um, one of those things to get some jelly. I'm out. Out of the old jelly. Oh yeah, everyone's sleeping. I need to wake them up. I always forget that I need to wake them. I mean, I don't care if they sleep. Wakey, wakey. Did you still... New request. I must be off. Finds Gwen's whereabouts. She's at the villa. She's definitely at the villa. I thought it was weird that I didn't have a quest for her anymore, but then I didn't see her on the boat either. She gone. Hello. That's a nice garden. Knock, knock. Who's there? Lettuce? Lettuce who? Lettuce in and you'll find out. <laughs> yeah, you're very funny. Very funny, bud. I need 10 linen thread for this. Large is 4,000, no problem. Iron and wool. Yeah, sheep corral, orchard, and windmill. Uh, oh, I need linen for the mailbox, too. I need to go make some linen. I'll be back, sir. I need to go make some linen real quick. I got a bigger boat. Someone sleeping again? I woke them all up. Load this bad boy up. And with this, I should be able to do what I need to.
Thank you. Go to get my mailbox and my next tier buildings. Craftsman. Oh, this needed oak too. This takes wool and iron. And I can get my mailbox. Massive sized boat. Chicken coop lounge crusher. Smithy cow stall cellar. Oh, there's only two more loot crate station upgrades. Interesting. <laughs> All right, see you, shark man. Thanks for the boat upgrade. New request. You've got mail. Letter from Albert. Uh, make sure you change your address permanently. You'll have more letters coming shortly. Make sure you keep up with your writing. Pen pals are the best pals. Everyone knows that. Albert, your local shipwright. Indeed. All right, what do I need to make my new buildings? A windmill takes aluminum. Did I? Oh, I never built my foundry. What the? Hello? Why is this thing so big? Okay. Orchards take nebula thread and a sheep takes copper. Alrighty, so that thing is massive. What the f Dude, it's way too big. What the? F what even fits on that? It's so tall. I mean, nothing. Oh, and look at the weird shape of its roof. Loom fits there. Let me just put this in the corner for a second. And move this somewhere else. Does the loom fit there too? Yeah, it fits perfectly right there. Nope. I mean, the cooking station fits there perfectly as well. Do you two fit together? Mm, not really. These two fit together? Also, not really, but kind of. Mm, that's one too tall. I'm just going to put this with this again. so ugly dude <laughs> well I can make metal now but I could have done that before I didn't even need to go get this upgrade oak marble and aluminum upgrade this my fishing rod I don't think I have any more upgrades right oh yeah the guest house I don't think I have any more blueprints though Go check this foundry out. Odd. What's odd? I wonder where Gwen could be. Maybe she took a trip to clear her head? Look for your friends, Stella. I agree. I think she's at the villa. How do you get in? Oh, right here. I can make copper and iron. I can only put five in at a time. Morning. 
Oh, we need a bellow. They want it in that range, but not too high. I see. I get it. Is it going to do all five at once? Yep. All right. You can put in empty bottles? What are these turn into? Ooh, look at that. Look at that range there. It's much more, uh, much more shallow. What happens if you overheat it? What do we get? New request, something to write home about. Just get glass. Okay. All right. What is this? Protest flyer and a raccoon ink flyer. Workers unite. Uh, we are done being paid unfair wages. We are done being exploited by the upper class. Say no to capitalist abuse. Rally to our cause. At Bottom Line Corp. Union for Working Denizens. Okay. Your customer due to an unforeseen supply shortage at our Bottom Line Corp Depot. Raccoon Inc. Long be able to apply our special rebate program for reoccurring customers. Please know this. Uh, great regret that we have to inform you of the situation and assure to value customer our continuous efforts to improve. Okay. Some labor disputes are happening. In other words. Very good. All right. Well, I think we're going to call the stream here. I am going to go get some food and stuff. I am hungry and I have not ate all day. But uh, yeah, that'll be it for this. I like this game. It's a very chill game. It's cute, I guess. Best way to describe it. <clears throat> and it's got some resource management and stuff. And I love that. I love that shit. So yeah, we'll be picking this up again in the future. But that is it for now. Like I said, so thanks everybody for watching. I uh, hope you guys have a great morning, afternoon, evening, whatever time of day it is. Have a great rest of your day, and I will catch you all later. See ya.